YouTube, hello, welcome to the stream. We're playing Silent Hill 3 today. The totally legal PS2 version. Uh, I'm gonna try and finish it today. Keyword try, if not, I don't know when part two is gonna be because there's quite a gap. The next week is all filled up, but we're gonna try and finish it today. Uh, if you haven't already, check out the Crab Game VOD I did with 40 other content creators. That was a lot of fun. And check out the Undertale uh, yeah, highlight if you haven't yet as well. Some great editing by Light there. Uh, also, check out Silent Hill 1 and 2 if you haven't already. It's going to be in the same playlist as this. And that's about it. Let's get right into it. Like, subscribe, buy something from the store, frameratemerch.com. Like this hat. Join the Discord, all that good stuff. YouTube, hope you enjoy. I love you. And I'll see you in a second. Do that. And then the full boot. Do I have audio? I do have audio. Okay. Dude. Let me change the thing here while this loads up. Hey, mister! You want to wrestle? Yeah, dude. On screen so the frogs can laugh at the backseaters. Oh. True. True. Some parts of this game may be considered violent or cruel. Some parts of the stream might be considered violent or cruel, so same. Oh, this song goes hard, by the way. idea if this is copyrighted by the way no idea might have to cut this out <laughs> Probably the most upbeat thing we're gonna hear this whole game. It's gonna get real fucking depressing real fast. Oh shit, it's a cutscene gun. That is not Date. Oh shit, is this the carousel from the first one? I guess this is a direct sequel, so it would make sense. How many Silent Hills are there? Uh, ooh. There's four numbered ones. And then... Total? I have no idea. Like, ten? I like that dramatic zoom of a ladder. We counting PT? No, because that never came out. That was just a demo. I guess you can add a half. Like eight and a half, nine and a half games. Then there's the remake coming out. Hell yeah. 
All right. Banger, dude. Banger. This game came out in 2003. I was 14. Make sure my settings saved. Uh, yep, yeah, they did. Cool. The only real setting was subtitles. New game. Uh, normal and normal, please. As per usual. So this is a direct sequel to one. We play as Heather Mason. Uh, Harry Mason's teenage daughter. I think we're like 17 in this game. 17 right here. So, yeah, we'll see what, what happens. Silent Hill 2 was its own, its own fucking thing. But, uh, this is the direct sequel to 1. Some people consider this their favorite Silent Hill, so I'm excited. Oh, we already have a thumbnail. Gail made it already. It's funny because when Silent Hill 2 came out, I know Silent Hill 2 is like cult classic. It's one of the best survival horror games of all time to some people. When Silent Hill 2 came out, people fucking hated it because it was its own thing and not a direct sequel to 1. Also, this game looks really good. Like, this is a PS2 game. Where am I? I don't have any, like, modifiers on this. What do you have? A knife! Alright. It's Robbie. I think his name's Robbie. A rabbit doll. No, it's a costume. Is there someone in there? It looks like there is, but I don't feel like making sure. Oh, something annoying about this game is, uh, if you, if there's dialogue on, or, like, if you interact with something, if you hit any button, like, even a direction, the dialogue goes away. So that's a little, that's annoying. Also, since this is a 2003 game on the PS2, the controls are fucking awful. But, we'll make do. Especially after playing Sign Hill 2 Enhanced Edition. Where all that shit was fixed. Excuse me. This thing controls like dog shit. But I mean, that's part of the charm, right? These early survival horror games are <laughs> didn't control well. There's a rabbit stuffed animal here. One thing that is annoying is uh, when you turn around, the camera doesn't automatically turn around. Like, you have to hit left trigger or L2 to turn it around. So, in the heat of battle, that's going to be a mess. There are lots of different styles, but I don't really want any of them. I'm getting out of this nasty place. If they had any tools now, they'd be a different story. Um, okay, so that's the menu. Radio, flashlight, the knife. Oh my god, what the fuck? Got a pipe? Handgun? An Uzi? What the hell? Sheesh. Bunch of goddamn things here. All right. Cool. It's a row of shirts for sale. Just like the shirts over at frameratemerch.com. Would you like to buy one? Please and thank you. We have them in all sorts of sizes from extra small, sometimes all the way to 4XL. Frameratemerch.com. Buy something, will you? I don't think they'd help me at all. The shirts over at frame... Yeah, dude. It's a rabbit stuffed animal here. The mouth part is stained red. Almost like blood stains. Disgusting. Oh, can I go in here? Whoops. Don't call the Uzi the Awoozy. I hate that. Fucking anime SMG. Uh oh. Holy sh- okay. Oh, how's the volume, by the way? Obviously, it's a little loud now because there's enemies fucking everywhere! Oh. 
I don't know what that is, but I hate it. Yep, thank you. This is, uh... This is all I played yesterday, by the way. Uh, this is a dream sequence. This is how I gotta handle the controls. So I know where I'm going here. But after this, I'm gonna be lost. And that's it. What'd you guys think? Not bad, right? Pretty short game. Yeah, that's the hype train right there. Shadow Sham, thank you for the 97. J Wise, Luxon Shaden, Moogle, Lazy Time, Froggy, Pirate Curly. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Do you like the lighting here? For a PS2 game is crazy. Just like shining through the blinds and shit. What a nightmare. Yeah, dude. I don't know if we'll ever get a remake for Silent Hill 1 or 3, but I hope so. At the very least, I hope there's an enhanced edition for this. Like there was for 2, because the 2 enhanced edition is so good. But who knows? Also, I, one is not getting any love. I think I think one is stuck on the PlayStation. Oh yeah, Silent Hill two and three, the HD versions definitely came out, and they are versions of the game that you should probably not play. <laughs> Dad, it's me. Yeah, sorry I didn't call sooner. Yeah, I guess I was. She's talking to Harry. Anyway, I'm coming home now. Oh, I didn't get that thing you asked me to. Okay. <laughs> okay, I will. I love you too, Dad. Hey, man. Heather, I need to speak with you. My name is Douglas Carter. Hi, Douglas. A detective. A detective? Really? Well, nice talking to you. Fuck you, she says. Hold on. There's someone that wants to meet you. Just let me have an hour. No, half an hour of your time. My daddy always told me not to talk to strangers. This is very important. It's about your birth. <laughs> yeah. I'm not. No, Heather. No, I think you should listen. Heather, you're the spawn of a girl that was burned alive and she split into two evil and good. Are you still you're the good. Me? You want you got to want to listen to this. Do I have to scream? Sorry. I'll wait. You were also like in a Chipotle burrito at the end of the first game. You gotta listen to this, cause I gotta assume Harry didn't bring that up. There was a demon, you know. Heather, you should Heather, you should listen to this. Oh shit! Someone's taking a dump. My bad. The mark on this mirror it looks so familiar somehow. Uh, what do I know it from? Where did I once see it? And why does my head hurt so much when I try to remember it? Oh! Uh... Oh, okay. Was that to show me all the save spots? Fucking 40 of them? Just this slut written in lipstick. You didn't watch the first Silent Hill, you don't know what I'm talking about? Oh, everything I said, by the way, is 100% true. Well, minus the Chipotle thing. That's because the 
the baby look like a burrito at the end of the game, but everything I said is true. The road is blocked with empty box and stuff I can't get through. What's the most safe space I've seen in the game? I have no idea, because I generally use one, maybe two, because I'm a crazy person. That's probably where I need to go. Well, that's helpful. Maybe I should walk around it. Never mind. But how did this car park here? All right, let's look at Heather's drip. She's got uh, about knee-high boots, got a green skirt, got a white vest. It's like winter on her chest and summer on her arms. She's got two orange wristbands and an orange shirt underneath. Tank top, maybe? Kind of like an Ashley Graham fit. Yeah, a little bit. Does she have a watch on? Oh, she does have a watch on, yeah. Oh, good thing she doesn't have two because it, <laughs> then it'd be time to diddle. Oh my God, camera, please. I assume all these doors are locked. Yep, all right. Cool mall. Everything is locked. I think the door over here is the one I need to go into. Don't want the light coming out of it, but... Isn't it crazy they made a whole game based on a Dead by Daylight character? God damn, the love this character got. Wild. Null and void. Thank you for the seven years. Yo, that's what good pussy sounds like. Am I right, fellas? Ladies? What am I even looking at? This looks like a flashlight. Was it like five bullets in a magazine? Uh, the most unsettling thing about this enemy and with Simon Hill is just the way they like shake and move and stuff. Ugh. What the hell is this thing? The twitch, yeah. It's unsettling. It's definitely not human. I've never heard of such an animal. And no way it is a costume. It sounds crazy when you say it, but monster is the only word for it. Whoa, don't say that. Monster energy might sue you. But I don't think I'm crazy. Oh, does this do the thing where she looks and there's... Oh, God. Okay. I have to pay attention to her head. She does the same thing in Silent Hill 2 where... Uh, you can miss items because you're not looking where she is... Uh, her face is looking. Uh, should I call the police? Not like they believe me if I said someone's been killed by a monster. It's not that I hate clothes, but it's this isn't the time or the place. Okay. Dressing room. Oh, is the fastest way to reload still like... Is it? Yeah. Do it there. Uh, my dad gave this to me on my birthday. It's one of my most treasured belongings. It's a jewel inside. When I asked dad what it was, he said, just the lucky charm. But then he told me to take good care of it and never take it off. Oh, good. It's my front door key. Daisy Villa apartment. I just doxed her. Whoops. My bad. Let's see. It's a switchblade for self-defense better with than without it against those monsters. I know it's terrible, but I just love walking around with this. Okay. And then, all right. What's the... Uh, how do you... Oh, right. We can, like, sidestep here. Oh, that is not a great... Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, so you can hold to stab or... Jesus. 
God, combat in these games are so bad. It's good enough, though, I guess. Well, that's how she holds the gun. <laughs> if I could fucking do this, I guess... I don't know if you could do this in Silent Hill 2, but you were able to do this with uh, her dad. Yeah, do you think she sticks her ass out when she uses the pipe as well? It's unlocked. It's just the poster. Big deal. Something about this face is a little creepy. Uh, Alright. What is this? Is this the map? Oh, thank God. Okay, we have a map. If there's anything I need, it's a map. How big is this mall? Uh, two floors. Three floors! Okay, first area of the game is ginormous. Where does this take me? Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Cool. Alright, well. Check that out later. Oh, is everything going to be locked over here? Yeah. Alright, excuse me. I'm going this way. Or I'm not. Uh, over here. Good. Good. How about over here? Oh, this says exit. Nice. Oh, we're back over here. That is where we came from. Yeah, this game is uh, very dark. I don't know if there's a way to up the brightness. Let me see if there is. Just in case it gets, like, too dark where I can't see. Oh, yes. Okay. We can go up to seven. I'll up it to four for now. <laughs> can someone point me to the Sabaro? Oh, my status was messed up. Do you see that? Oh, it's fixed now. Totally legal PS2, by the way. Do you think they got an Ani Ans in here? Oh, God, I hope so. Camera, please. I want to see what's in front of me. Yep. Thank you. Oh, we're back here. Was I here before? Oh, yeah. I just want to circle. Uh, what door can I open? Oh, I can't zoom in. Okay, cool. Oh, maybe that staircase thing? Yeah, I think maybe that's it. All right, it was... Oh, I'm going to cut through the door. I just went past. Yeah, dude. Can I use this? I push the button, but the elevator won't come. Yeah, is it broken or something? Dude. Oh, yeah, probably. Uh, oh wait, there's another door over here. Did I not click on this? I guess I completely missed the exit door. All right, we're going upstairs. Load screen. What the fuck is that? Ew! fuck is that? I hate it? Oh, an open door. Oh, my God. Uh, I got beef jerky? What? Processed dried meat. Sometimes it's just enough to distract the monsters. Oh, is it? Oh, it's literally just to distract him, I guess. I think that was showing me the dog wasn't aggroed because it was having beef jerky. Hell yeah. Oh, healing items. Nice. Okay. That's good because I try to not use ammo unless I absolutely need to. Ooh, a key. Something's fallen between the table and the floor. I think it might be a key. 
If my arms were a little longer, I might be able to reach it. There's a huge pile of cardboard boxes on the table full of books. It's way too much of a pain to move something that heavy. Okay, so we need something to grab the key. Okay. Yeah, dude. Oh, she's talking about an altar or some shit. All right. Sorry, I skipped that text. I thought it was going to be the same. I really do think she could stick her hand under that pallet if she really wanted to, but... She's a 17-year-old kid. What do you expect? Oops. It's just video game logic, yeah. Also, yeah, did she call the pallet a table? Yeah, dude. Excuse me. Whatever the fuck you are. I think it came from over here, right? Yes. Okay. All right. We are, uh... Oh, in this little circular area here. Helen's Bakery. Oh, I should probably try and go in these. What's up, Spencer? Oh, shit, bread! Oh, can I grab these tongs? Is that why it's... Oh, do I use these tongs to get the fucking key? <laughs> what the fuck? It's bread! Man, it sure is. Shout out to bread. But I'm not really hungry, so I guess I don't need to worry about it. Oh, yeah, but we got some inventory space. Do you want to... Do you want to grab some bread just in case? Okay, we can make our way back. But let's see what else is over here. Uh, key of beauty. That's locked. Boutique. Hey, man. How's it going? I'm just going to walk around. Oh, Jesus. Cafe Paradise. My best sellers. Oh, that, that needs a key. There's a lock on it. Natalie Shoes. Shout out to Natalie. Good luck on her business. All right. Sunshine Princess. I'm an adult virgin. Didn't need that. Thank you for my self esteem. Oh, we're going to circle. Okay. Scariest game in the or scariest room in the game for the gluten free crowd. That's locked. Wobbles is over here somewhere. Hey, Wobbles. He's not even aggroed. Excuse me. Oh, I think it's by the door over here. Alright. Hey, Heather, make sure you click the tongs to make sure they work. Oh, she didn't click them. Idiot. Key taken with tongs. This seems so unnecessary. That's survival horror. Uh, examine. Oh, my best sellers. Okay, we just saw that. So we have to head back. Oh, oh fuck. What was the quick save? Was it F1 on my legal PS2? Oh, it helps if I turn my keyboard on. Idiot. Yes. Okay. That way, if we get into a rut and we die a lot, I can just quick load at a save point. Um. Oh! Oh, you got homies now, huh? You got friends? You got a bunch of goddamn freakers over here. Excuse me. All right. Oh, big gulps, huh? Excuse me. These, uh... These guys are spooky. Thank you for the store order. Key taken with tongs. Alright, we're in. Okay. Oh, I think this is the bookstore with the, uh, the Shakespeare puzzle. If you're on hard, you're kind of fucked. Oh, some ammo. And gun bullets. Let's see. Locked. Oh, there's a code there, yeah. So that's what I need to figure out. What does this say? 
Fair is foul and foul is fair. Put these books out of order. Okay. Yeah, dude. Yep, there they are. No, these books are very interesting. Just the kind that I can buy anywhere. All right. This is the only place where there's any room left. Should I just line up the books I picked up off the floor? Yeah, fucking probably. Oh, I have to write. It doesn't auto. All right. Shakespeare Anthology 1. Oh, what is that on the spine? A number, perhaps? Ooh. Uh, oh, I have to like do it like this? Okay. Uh, where's three? Oh, okay. That is not correct. Was it like seven zero six five? Maybe. A seven zero six five. All right. Nice and easy. That's way easier than having to actually know Shakespeare. YouTube, do you do you know any Shakespeare? Because I didn't, I wasn't taught it at all in high school or anything like that. Never read anything, nothing like that at all. I don't know anything about it. Just, I completely avoided all that shit. Well, not avoided, I just wasn't taught it. Um, hey, wait, what's going on? Where is everybody? Those weird monsters? They have come to witness the beginning. The rebirth of paradise, despoiled by mankind. What are you talking about? <laughs> She's got a turtleneck. Don't you know? Your power is needed. How should I know? Ooh. I am Claudia. Some free grippers? So Let's go. Remember me and your true self as well. Also, that which you must become. The one who will lead us to paradise with blood-stained hands. Why is she whispering? Claudio, right? Did you do all this? It was the hand of God. Isn't the main villain from one? No, the main villain from one dies. I forgot what her name is, but it wasn't Claudia. At least I don't think it was. Yeah, it was Dahlia. I get it. What does she want me to remember? Silent Hill 1, you didn't play it? There were those weird, like, baby things in the school that I was, like, shooting and, like, bonking with a pipe. There's that time I got lost in the hospital because I didn't pick up the map. You know, usual stuff. You know, where you play as your dad who has a fat ass. <laughs> He's a big ass dumpy. We're just going. Oh, there's no buttons on this elevator. All right, that's spooky. All right, there's the radio. A radio, what the hell is this doing falling down from the ceiling? Anyway, I guess that explains the static from just before. But all it's picking up is static. I wonder if it's broken. Would you like um or foom? Is this a dream? It's gotta be. Oh, 
Oh, we're descending to hell. Great. Not even a kid could believe in this. But when am I going to back up? Oh god, the fucking stop the twitching, please. Ugh. Oh, we're just here now. Does my map still work? Oh, we're on the first floor. Okay. Oh, okay. What do you fucking mean? Why do you get off my leg? Oh, this is this is bad. Oh god. Okay. Yep. Yep. I don't know where I'm going. I need a door to open. I'm getting fucking mauled. Oh, this is please open. Nope. Everything is locked down here. Can I get an open door so I can just, like, assess the situation? If I come back out here, I think I need to use jerky. Are all these fucking doors closed? Cool fucking map! Oh, thank God. Anyway. What was this? Oh, the fucking, the good healing thing. Dude, shit is super locked. There are books and magazines here, but I have no time to read them. Yeah, the butt plug. How are we looking from, like, the status? Uh, oh, we're in the yellow. I guess we'll use a... Uh, oh, it's in supplies. I got five. Yeah, I'll use it. Cool. Anything else in here? All right, cool. We got a save point here, so we can explore a little bit. The bed is stained dark red. Whose blood is this? Is there someone here apart from that woman? I don't know. This again, sometimes at looking at it makes my head hurt, but at the same time, it looks so familiar. I know I've forgotten something really important, but I also have the feeling that I'd be better off not remembering. All right. Bop. Let me also up the brightness because it is like super dark. What are memos again? Oh, memos are like notes, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. Hello, Eno. There goes my status. All right, let's try six. Okay. Oh my god, I could see a little bit. All right. If we die... Oh, let me uh, drop a quick save here, since I just saved. If I die, I die, but we saved, and we could explore a little bit. And the dogs are literally still right here. Yep. This door. No, this door. Possibly this door? How about this door over here? Please be open. Thank god. Uh, oh, good. I'm, dude, I'm just moving. I'm moving and grooving. I have no idea where the fuck I am or going. All I know is I'm in a mall. The, uh, camera shifting just scared me. That's just a ladder. Like, what the fuck is this, like, angle? A ladder is hanging halfway down from the ceiling. Even if I stand on the table and stretch my hands out, I can't reach it. If only I had something long to snag it. Okay, well, we're looking for a little, like, grippy hand that you buy for, like, your mom so she could reach shit in the pantry. Also, yeah, can I just, like, jump? Okay, so that's... Where are we now? You know, can you not trigger me with the flashlight? Thanks. All right, we have a whole bunch of shit to explore over there. Okay. Okay, these guys are more... E these guys are easier to avoid. The fleshlight enemies. Oh, this is all locked. 
Oh, oh there's three of them. Nice, dude. Excuse me. The thing that sucks is when you check a door and there's like text on screen, it doesn't freeze. Like, they can still come after you. Oh my god, the shadows. Okay. What we got in here? Uh, oh, we got a first aid kit. Some more ammo. Of course, if you've seen me play Sun Hill 1 and 2, I almost like never use my ammo. Because I'm a fucking idiot. That's the wrong way. Yeah, dude. Anyone taking a dump in here? Anyone taking the Browns to the Super Bowl? What is this? Oh, bleach. Good. If things go real bad, just drink that. Is someone actually in there? Uh. Hello? That is a disgusting, bloody-ass toilet. At least I think that's blood. I'm not going in there. You know what? I've seen enough. Someone was fighting for their life in there, and I think they lost. Oh, not again. Okay. I hate these dogs. I hate these dogs. Oh, shit. Oh. Okay. Just made it in here. Oh. Should be something here, but it's too dark to see. If only I had a flashlight. What? It It's right in front of you. What do you just grab it? Damn, bitch, I know it's dark. I don't think it's that dark. Jesus Christ! Woo! That was rude. I guess I can only see it because I upped the brightness to six. I guess in-game Heather doesn't have, uh, doesn't have that luxury. Alright, we have to keep looking around. Is that a fucking bulletproof vest? Can I, can I wear that? All right, uh, we need to get our flashlight. Uh, okay. Let's keep looking. Yep. Hmm. All right. I think I have to come back later. No, 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 no. All right. Okay. Are there any other rooms in here I haven't been in? I don't think so. All right, let's head back. Oh, this is the, uh, this is the dookie bathroom. Okay. I need the, I obviously need the flashlight to progress, but I would also like the flashlight just to, like, see. Or for hopefully help chat see. Um... No, this is locked. Was it in the fucking... Was it in this room? No, right? This is the... This is the... The, the stair or the ladder room. And this is locked, right? Okay. Maybe we have to go further back. Uh, okay. Yeah, dude. Back to the dog room. Excuse me, fellas. Heather, please. Well, there's one room we didn't check.
Guarantee you it's locked. Yep. Uh, okay. Well, I guess it's in a room we've been to already. Can I write this back up? No. They are going to town on something. It does sound like they're eating ass, yeah. This is the safe, first save room, right? All right. Uh... Time to just mash A or try to look at Heather's fucking head to see if she finds, looks at a flashlight or some shit. Hmm. All right. Guess we'll go out to the left yeah, again. Dude. There's not too many places that I can check. I don't know what those dogs are distracted with. I guess there's a piece of jerky over there, but like... Oh! Are you kidding me? Good fucking spawn, idiot. Yeah, because this is all just like... Closed. Is it this one? No, I think I checked all this stuff. Um, is there like anything in this corner? I don't think there is. Where the fuck is this flashlight? Alright, let me try back in here. This is the... Oh, it's this room again. Okay. Warning, when leaving the room, be sure to turn out the lights. It will be obvious if they are not switched off. Are you... What was it? Between the boxes? Oh, damn. Alright. Well, we got a flashlight now. Good. Now we can go get the... The... Was it the body armor and the... The hanger? I assume the hanger's for the uh, ladder. I got a hanger. That seemed like a useless room. There was items in there. You could have bulletproof vests. What the fuck? Uh, where would that be? I guess under items? It's heavy under a jacket, but it should protect against monster attacks. Oh, so does it make you, like, slower, but you can take more damage? Let me see. And what is this? The sort of stuff you use to clean a toilet, I think I have the same kind at home. The bottle says danger. Do not mix. All right. Well, we have that disgusting toilet uh, that we can check. Oh, you definitely move slower. Oh, that is a... Hmm. I wonder how manageable that is. <clears throat> we'll, uh, we'll leave it on for now. And we'll see how it feels. Oh, God. Oh, but slow. All right. Oh, hey, I can see the toilet now. Oh, great. Am I supposed to use bleach in here? Oh, I can't use it in here. Damn. Am I supposed to combine it with the hanger? Damn it. Did someone respond or is it just me? Yeah, dude. I think it's just you. I hope it's just you. Oh, combine it with the jerky and feed it to the dogs? Dude, that even you know what? Even though these are like demon dogs, that's fucked up. That's fucked up. I need you guys to like hug the left side. Or just one at a time, that works too. You guys keep eating that ass. Okay, well, he's de -aggroed. Or he's aggro now. Serpentine. 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 Cool. Remember when you had to melt the wax and put the horseshoe in the hole? Oh, to lift up. Yeah. 
boy, do I. This is the wrong room, but I'm going to save here, actually. That was, uh... Sign hole 2, in that prison area. Yeah, dude. Rachel, thank you for the 83. Quick save as well. Alright, we need to go... Oh, it was in that room. Fuck me. It was where the big dudes are. It's right. Um, okay. I fucked up. Okay, hopefully we're done. Son of a bitch. Hopefully we're done in here. Can you guys just not spawn by the door? What ending am I going for? It's my first ever playthrough. So whatever one I get. Come on, Heather. Nice. All right. Let's head on up. There's like nothing, like this is still locked, right? Yeah, okay. Stride, thank you for the 90 months. Am I gonna get the worst ending possible? To keep up with my streak? Yeah, probably. Especially if there's like some cryptic thing I'm supposed to do that I have no idea what to do in my first playthrough. Why would something like this be here? This isn't a hospital. This isn't a beach, this is a bathtub. There's a TV over there. <laughs> All right. I can't see anything. I can't hear anything. What was that, I wonder? We're all going to die in seven days. All right, that's a fun room. I was actually surprised that door was open. Like 90% of the shit in here is closed. Oh, I can go down this way. Interesting. Oh, uh, no, I can't. Just kidding. Just kidding. Oh, safe spot. Nice. The safe spot on the TV. Jump coward? I'm not sure if the game lets you. Oh, this is open as well. Glass is totally broken in the showcase, uh, and it's totally empty. That's too bad. A wa a walnut. What? There was a nice silver ring in here the last time I came. Bummer that it's gone now. Why the fuck? All right. Well, we got a nut. Elevator's broken. Lock is broken, of course. This big, big, large, huge. Around this corner, probably. Yeah, like way over there. You know what? I think before I go do this, I should go to that other room with the enemies in it. With the weird, like, creepy guys. Yeah, dude. Let me also examine this nut. This is a good-sized walnut. Uh, from the jeweler showcase something's rattling around inside, but I can't open it with my bare hands. Oh, that's okay. We'll combine it with the bleach damn it <clears throat> Excuse me All right, there's like a bunch of enemies in here, right? Uh, oh, there is all right. You know what time for combat 
Yep, this is just as bad as I thought it would be. Hey, it works for the most part, I guess. What if the knife would be more viable? It actually doesn't have that much range. God damn it. Oh, is ammo right here? I'm healing. Oh, actually, you know what? I just saved, so if I die, it's not the end of the world. I can just see, like, what I need in here. Without wasting ammo. Up. Uh, Oh, I thought I was dead. <laughs> she was just fucking planked out. Uh. Oh, there's a door over here. Oh, does this take me to the same area? Oh, it takes me to the same spot. Alright, well, that was fucking pointless. I had to just take a little break, I guess. Oh, there's one more door I could check. Oh, two more doors, two more doors. Oh, this is where I came from, okay. It, it, is all this shit locked? This is that one door over there. Hmm. Alright, well. Is it this one? No. Oh, this is, okay, this is it, but it is locked. Um, alright. I guess we'll just head back the way we came. With these guys camping the door, because of course they are. Alright, fellas, hey, I'm gonna kill you again. Because I think there might be something in here. Is there anything in here worth grabbing? Or is this just like a shortcut to the room? Ooh, nice mannequin. Bunch of dismembered mannequins. Dirty boxes. Fuck, maybe there is nothing in this room. Fuck me. Alright. I've seen the Resident Evil Death Island trailer. It looks so bad, I can't wait to watch it. Hmm. Alright, well, there's gotta be something in here. Not in this room, but like the next room. Because I don't know what else we have. Where's this fucking enemy at, by the way? Found it. Found it. Do I have to go, like, back downstairs? Bro, everything in this mall is fucking locked. Hmm, maybe the other escalator? All we have is, uh, yeah, all we have is the nut. I assume this is another dead end. Yep. All right. Oh, that works. Fuck the ladder. I'll just jump down. Uh, yeah, where the fuck would I crack a nut in this game? I have no idea. Yo, Nick, by the way, thank you for the bits. Anyone have a good idea where we could crack some nuts? Because I don't think there's anything else up there. There's that locked door, but that's about it. 
The only key I have is uh, the key to my apartment. I'm not sure if that would help here. this room again. Oh, shit. Yikes, I didn't... Please turn. I'm not healing, by the way, because if we die, then we haven't really made much progress besides the nut, so it's... Really not that big of a deal. Were there escalators going up? Uh, oh, actually there might be. Hold on. Let me check the map. Uh, oh yeah, I guess so. Were they blocked? I don't know if they were blocked. We can go check. Excuse me. You know what? I can't. Much better. If I'm going to be lost running around a lot, I need to be at maximum speed. Oh, you can go up these. Okay. Nice. Perfect. For some reason, I thought these were blocked. Alright. Alright. Oh, the camera ship was great. Locked. Locked. Oh, okay. There's text on there, but the enemies don't stop. I might have to kill that enemy so I can read it. Oh my god, an open door? In this economy? Hmm. Alright, this is literally just a bathroom. <coughs> Another cursed bathroom. Alright, I don't know what we do in here. It's like a light switch or something. We have to do this again. Alright, this does seem like a pointless room, but I feel like that's not the full meaning. Hmm. I checked the doors over here, right? Oh, no, no, there's more, there's more. That's locked. That's locked. Hey, alright. Little restaurant? Is that a dog? There's something in the dog's stomach. A cooked key. Cool. Great. Health drink. Meds. Hmm. I can't examine it. All right. I assume it's just for this. The lock is broken. Oh, I wonder if it's for the door downstairs in that area. Hmm. Let me go see. Now we're making progress. I may I may reload my save here. Let me just see if this opens up the door. I think it does. 
which was I think you go left into this alcove. Yep. All right. Progress. Well, the game is giving me a bunch of health. Oh, a pipe. Oh my god, an actual weapon? A weapon that I have no problem using? A steel pipe about three feet long, not very powerful, but not hard to use. Alright. Bonk. Okay. Pipe is kind of all reliable here. All right, let me practice this combat here. Yep. <laughs> this is so. Okay, those guys die pretty easily if we lock it in. Is there something down there? Besides a big fucking ladder? Hey, buddy. Hey. Hey. Right in his ass. Yeah, I don't know what the best attack is there. At least those guys are kind of easy to kill. Uh... Detergent. Oh. Should probably mix out with the bleach, I assume. Let's see. Hmm. <coughs> oh. Oh, it's for the bathroom. Oh, do I have to go all the way back to that stinky bathroom? I think I do. Oh, wait, what's that down there? Under the sink. That's a pipe. Okay, good. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna heal. Let's just let it fly. Let's let it fly. Yeah, dude. Okay, so it's... Looks like it's three smalls or one big. All right. Hmm. All right. It's weird. All these doors. Oh, well, my fucking God. I'm going to guess this hurts. Yes. I'm not going any further. It's creepy and dangerous to boot. There's got to be a way. I can't very well stab one by one. Some insecticide will do it. Okay. So we need insecticide. I'm going to write this down. If I turn this on, does this make a difference? No. Okay. <clears throat> Watch out for the black Doritos, yeah. I guess we'll make our way back to that bathroom. Or, because I, I think that's our next goal. Or maybe if we find insecticide somewhere. Anything else in here? Uh, no. Oh, this is where he came from. Okay, this is just big. Big circle area. Okay. <clears throat> this is where we got the pipe. Excuse 
Excuse me. Alright, I think the gross bathroom was downstairs. Let me save. I think it's where all the dogs were fucking vibing. So we have to go do that shit again. Possibly. Let's check the map. Uh, yeah, uh, actually. Oh no, it's over here. It's in this area. Okay. Oh yeah, pre is on Tuesday for the Rose Crown. I keep going to the same fucking room. Let me go further up. Did I pass it? Uh, sure did. Oh, the room's right next to each other. That's the problem. It's this one. Alright. Uh. So... Oh, I really can't use this here? What the fuck? I thought I could. I thought the whole thing was to be like, oh, use it in bathrooms. Damn it. Oh, am I supposed to combine both of these and then, like, use it against the, uh, bugs? Was that actually it? The items don't turn into another item, so I, I, I don't know why I thought they would. All right, I think we have to go back to the insects. Oh, pardon me. <laughs> I don't think putting the nut into the toilet is the solution. But it might be. We might be coming right back here. How's my Sunday going? It's going all right. Can't complain. Is this going to be like the bread in Legend of Zelda? Fucking, it might be. Like, will it work if I combine these and then, like, use it? Do I make insecticide? Also, yeah, I have no idea what this fan does, either. Up, oh, sorry. Wait, if I, like, I'm gonna make insecticide. Wait, combine. Use. There you go. You are. Where did that bucket come from? What? And then I turn this on. Will that work? Where? Oh, yeah, they're all dead. Was the bucket in the corner? Okay. Somehow I didn't pass out from that, but okay. Anyway, we solved that. that bunch of ammo okay this is more jerky <laughs> okay let 
That's a long ass hallway, huh? Yep. All right, let's check behind us. Uh, this is Harry's adopted daughter, yeah. Remember the Chipotle burrito at the end of one? That's us. Okay. Um. Oh, not these fucking guys. Okay, where are we on this map? That is such a good noise. Alright, so we can go back over there. Um, I don't think there's anything in here. Uh, no. Okay, this is just a transition room. We'll leave him alive. Okay. Locked. Locked. Fucking Christ. Oh, okay. Yep. All right, we gotta go that way. Me alone. Lucky. Oh, yikes. That was a safe point. What is this? Oh, is this why I crack the nut? Yeah! I'm busting a nut! Let's go. What did I get? No nut in the walnut shell, just a jewel. A moonstone. Oh, shit. Could evolve my Nidoran. Or Nidorino, I guess. Okay, so I'm guessing that's for that crescent door thing. It said something about a moon, uh, but I really couldn't read it because I was getting attacked by 18 enemies. Uh, okay. Cool. Moonstone. Is there dog ending in this game? I don't know. There's usually a joke ending, like in the first one had the UFO ending. Uh, the second one had the dog ending and the UFO ending, but I'm not sure about this one. Where the fuck is this? Oh, this is back over here, but it's... Oh, hey, man. Is that enemy doing cartwheels? Kind of. And making the most annoying sound in the world? Yup. Oh, there's just enemies in here now. Okay. Uh, hey guys, I just need to pass. Camera, can we, like, work together? Does the jerky work? I think the jerky just works on the, uh, on the dogs. But I just run past them because you can run past them most of the time. Hello, Cece. <clears throat> I know there's going to be bosses in this game, so I'm just kind of mostly saving my ammo for that. All right, we're just going to run immediately and try to use this. Oh, good. Good spawn. Good spawn. Yep. Cool. 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 I wish I could just use it. Then have to pull up the menu and stuff. Alright. I'm in here now. Okay, that's the ladder in the middle. Okay. 
Okay. This guy just wandering around. I guess he's on a lower level, because I've circled this whole thing and I didn't see him. Oh shit, that's not what I wanted. Hey, see ya. Okay. Let's head down. What a thrill, but backwards. Do I have any items left? Like, I guess not. This looks kind of sus. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Gee, you think this is the boss? Oh! Oh, it peels back the foreskin! Oh! We're finding uncircumcised peepee. -pee. It's just peeling it back. Hey, kid. You don't want to wrestle that. You don't. Not at all. Yeah, symbolism for... I don't... Who the fuck knows? Alright. Um, I mean, I guess this is what we had our pistol for, right? Uh, how many bolts do we have? 86. Uh. Oh, just like in real life, if you want to attack a man in the dick, you gotta peel the foreskin back for maximum damage. Friendly tip for the ladies out there. I get the symbolism now. Uh. Oh, is this it? Does it just go back and forth? That's not too bad. Oh, okay. See ya. Ray, why'd you, why would you blow our cover? I'm so sorry. Because I'm an ally. You know? Alright, yeah, you get like four shots off. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I don't like the teeth either. I mean, the whole monster is, uh, creepy as fuck, but the teeth, gotta say though, it's got some good chompers. Oh, is that the whole fight? Okay. All right, well, that was easy. The fucking dog's enemies were harder. All right, well, cool. What a fight, listen. If there's one thing Silent Hill is not known for, it is for combat. Got some interesting boss fights, but that is not one of them. Oh, hey, the mall's back. What? That took like 20 bullets, if that. It's the shopping mall just like before. Oh my god, the Jimmy fight. One of the worst boss fights I've ever fucking done. Am I back? All right. So I guess we finished the first area. That wasn't too bad. How are we on health? I think we're still okay on health. Still okay on ammo. Bust out the pipe. Alright, that area took about an hour and a half. <laughs> hey, I don't think we're finishing this game today. I know how long to beat has it listed at like six hours. But I was walking around with a nut for like ever. Oh yeah, Eddie. I forgot what name I said. But yeah, that, that dweeb. Well, what was, whole, what was Eddie's thing? Like, someone... Didn't he, like, kill a dog or something? I don't know. The characters in Sign Hole 2 are real, real fucked up. 
Oh, he was bullied for being fat. So he killed, like, the dude's dog and I think the dude or some shit. I can go in there. Yeah, I think we're just, I think we're just out of here. Yeah, like, I don't know how many areas are in this game. Oh, let me go save. But, uh, yeah. I'm not sure if we'll finish it today. Yeah, shot a football player in the knee to, like, ruin his career, and then, uh... Oh, I can't go back in here to save. Never mind. And then shot his dog. What's up, Sarah? Yeah, dude. All right. Hey, Douglas. What just happened? You must be one of them. What did I do? And what do you mean by one of them? You're in on this with that Claudia, aren't you? Claudia? What about her? She asked me to find you, that's all. So you are one of them. Claudia did all that? Look, I was just hired to find you. I'm not on anybody's side. I don't know anything about this. Why don't you start by telling me what happened here? And that monster. What the hell was that? Which one? I don't know. You are my dad. You're my dad. You're my dad. Rookie, rookie, rookie. I'm getting really screwy around here and... I got a weird feeling it's got something to do with me. Maybe you're just an innocent bystander, but I, I can't feel sorry for you because you dragged me into this. You know, if you hadn't found me... What are you talking about? What's so special about you anyway? If I knew that, I wouldn't be so confused, would I? You are my dad. You're my dad. Wookie, wookie, wookie. Something I've been running from and forgot for a long time. How did I remember that? What's wrong? Nothing. Where are you going? I'm taking the subway home. What should I do? How if I know? <laughs> Why are you asking me? What? <clears throat> Dude, I'm a 17 year old kid. I don't know what the fuck you should do. See ya! Uh, Scarecrow, thank you for the 10 gifted. Gavin, thank you for the 1. Recon, Zook, thank you. Alright, everyone be on the lookout for a map. We didn't pass it, right? No, okay. A subway connected to the mall. What is this, New York? I think Sun Hill takes place in, like, uh, in Maine or some shit. <clears throat> I've thought about playing through Deadly Premonition. I don't know if I can, dude. That game is supposed to be real, real, real rough. Like, it's a lot of jank. I can handle some jank, but I don't know if I would find that game fun. I need to play a little bit off stream to see if I'd be willing to uh, do a full playthrough. Hey, by the way, gamers, uh, hey, stash your trash. All right? Stash your trash. What'd that say? Oh. 
<clears throat> There's a newspaper left on top of the ticket machine. Fatal accident at Hazel Street. Well, that's where I am. Good. At about 11 p.m. on the 4th, a man waiting on the platform at the Hazel Street station fell onto the tracks and was decapitated by the arriving St. Renata College bound train. The victim died instantly. Oh, as opposed to getting decapitated and living a little bit. Thank you, journalist. While police have not yet determined whether the death was an accident or suicide, witnesses report that the victim did not look inebriated and seemed to jump off the platform deliberately. The victim's identity is unknown. He was approximately 40 years old, 5 feet 10, and was wearing a black jacket. The newspaper is four months old. What's it doing here now? Damn. It's a subway map here, but even without looking at this, I still know my way home. I just need to get to the... Oh, Bergen. Let's see. Let me just write that down. Bergen Street at Platform 3. Sure. What's up, Blitz Sox? Thank you for the 97 months. Hmm. Can I actually, like... I have to go to the right. All right. I guess I go there, too. Oh, good. I hear some creepy noises. Wonderful. Dude, this game should just be called The Lock is Broken. I can't open the door. Jesus. down here. Where does this bring me? I wonder if this is all going to be locked. I'm going like a completely different way than I'm supposed to. Yep. Yep. Yep, thank you. Hey, man. I think I went too far down. Stash your trash. What kind of bullshit that they put an enemy at the bottom of the stairs. Path is blocked with trash. Oh, there's more to go down. And now we're back to just a nor- What the fuck? Oh, that's a dead body. Uh, is someone sleeping here? All this red stuff around here is blood. This guy's not sleeping. Why am I not the least bit surprised? There was something else there, but I moved. Oh, there's ammo and health and stuff. Okay. Well, uh, enjoy your nap. It looks like I can grab that can, but I don't think I can. All right, let me see if I can figure out how this jerky works. This is probably like a waste of it, but... All right, I left the jerky. Guys, the jerky? The jerky? Works great. Let's head back to, uh, I guess, where we're supposed to go. That's not Jack Link's emergency exit, huh? That's a safe spot. All right. Guess I'll heal. Yeah, dude. I'm liking the game so far. Uh, not impressed so far. Fucking, the maps look cool, but 90% of it's locked. 
Game looks real good, though. I feel like there's been way more locked areas than the other two games combined. Uh, I like the first and second one a lot. I forget you turn your flashlight off. <clears throat> I read this a long time ago. It's a, it's a nothing little occult magazine. Seemed like a bunch of crap to me. It's not so bad if you just read it for fun, though. The souls of those who died suddenly by suicide or accident don't realize they're dead. Sometimes they stay put and haunt that particular place. These spirits have lost their human senses and memories and can only keep replaying the pain and sadness of the moment they died. The pain can get so bad that they turn to humans for salvation or they begrudge humans uh, the, uh, their lives. At such times, they can possess humans. Places known as famous suicide spots or high accent areas are often to blame. You should be careful when approaching such locations, especially on the day or at the time the death occurred. That is, if you don't want it to happen to you too. Ooh, spooky. Spooky. Fried Fox, thank you for the five gifted subs. Thank you. I guess wherever the map is in this area, I missed it. Oh, is this the whatever pushed me? Uh, what the fuck do you mean? What do you mean? I guess it did tell me not to go to the area. That's on me. Okay. Wow, so I just, you just get pushed by a spirit and you die, huh? All right, well, cool. Cool. Guess that's that. So does the same thing happen if I don't read it? Oh, I meant to make a fucking quick save at that save spot. I'm just going to put it here. You have to read it. Oh, okay. So I didn't read it this time. So will it not happen? I want to check the other side too. Like, does it register that I read it before? Oh, yeah, I guess it does. Interesting. Uh, fuck, how do I quick save? Oh, I see what I need to do. Hold on. Nope. Quick load is that. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I see what I did. Sorry, this is an old, uh, old thing. I could fix this. Hold on. Do, 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 do. Hello? Okay. Think my emulator is broken? Hold on one second, chat. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on one second. Uh, there we go. Okay. Sorry about that. It kept loading the same thing. We're back. To, we're back to where we were. All right. Anyway, we're fine. So if I go back this way. This is a different way, right? Same. Oh, this just takes me in a circle. Okay. Um, I think that's where I need to go, but I can't go that way without dying. So maybe that isn't where I need to go. Whoops. Move that mouse out of the way. Virgin. Hmm. 
fuck, I really wish I had a map. Let's try over here. Same area. Oh no, there's enemies over here. Okay. Oh, this is actually Bur Burgeon Street. I was on the other one, the other platform. I see now. This seems risky. I think I'm supposed to go the other way, but I'm, let me check over here. Oh no, it's the same thing. I still die, I think. Yeah, maybe I was supposed to go the other way. Okay. Because that door was locked. Hmm. Really wish I had a map. Uh, level one gamer, thank you for your bitch. Happy birthday! I bequeath these bits to you. As I shall turn to dust soon. <laughs> Hey, happy birthday. Thank you so much. Happy 35th birthday. Okay, so this seems like possibly the way to go. Throw the jerky in front of the train. A concept. Oh, no, this is back on Hazel Street, right? No, no, this is where we were before. Okay, so can I, like... Instead of going the way I went, can I drop down and go that way? Or is this... If I just get on this, am I just dead? Like, no matter what? Okay, you're dead no matter what. Okay, so where the fuck do we go here? Poor Heather's getting hit by a train, like, 18 times. I'm so sorry. This seems like the right way, because there's enemies here, but it's all, like... You know, if I step in the, the tracks, it's bad. I was able to go further on the other side, but I'm not sure if that makes a difference. She keeps getting hit by the hype train. <laughs> We've only had one, so I don't know the other train she's getting hit by. Uh, let's see. Is over here anything different? I don't think so, right? I think I've checked this. Or have I? Fucking everything looks the same. I don't, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fuck, it scared me. I don't think we've been here. Good quality, good taste. Yeah, I think we're just back over here. Back by the, like, the other side. Yeah, we have to go to the Hazel section. Not the Hazel section, I'm sorry. The, uh, the, the Bergen. Bergen? Alright, so let's go back over there. What's up here? This is difficult, like, navigating a train station. It's not too bad. It's just, like, everything's fucking locked. And I don't have a map. Okay, yeah, we were here earlier because these are the two bathrooms that are locked. All right, well, let's go back over here to where we're so theoretically supposed to go. This is giving me New York City flashbacks, yeah? I just don't have my Metro card, and there's not, like, 6,000 people in, like, one small spot. All right, so back here. It, it is cleaner than a New York subway. That is true. That's the most unrealistic thing about this. It's actually, uh, it's clean. There's nothing on this side, right? Oh, I guess there is. Have I gone this way? Also, no murder ghosts. Yeah, those are just real people, actually. 
All right, I'm on this side now. Is this different? Well, maybe. Oh, I don't want to jump in the track. Oh, maybe I don't have to. Bro. Where the fuck are we going? I assume I'm supposed to get on a train. Preferably one that doesn't destroy me, but... Alright, let's go back to the other side. This part of the game sucks. Good. Great. I'm operating on the concept that, like, oh, there's enemies here, so this is the right way. But I also don't know where to go. Like, I don't know if I need to kill these dogs. I don't know if this, if this is even the right spot. But, I mean, this is, this is the street. Excuse me. Ow, ow, ow. Oh my god, please get around the dog. The dog. Besides me just getting bit by a dog over and over again. The, do the dogs do sound like cheetahs, they do. Let me go back over to this side. Unless I'm not actually supposed to come to this side at all. Which would be a big, uh... Oh, Tina text. A big bait. Tina just took the dogs on a long walk. Cool. Bait from 20 years ago? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, I didn't... <sighs> Bro, I don't know. I guess I'll just keep walking around for a little bit more and then maybe I'll just stumble upon excuse me where we're supposed to go yeah dude hmm I keep, keep coming back to this area as, like, the home base because this is where the save is. And I thought we were making good progress, but everything looks the same and I'm kind of just going in circles. Okay, so this is the same area we were in before. Let's just keep stumbling around. Oh, this is back over here where the dogs were at. Where the jerky did uh nothing. If that jerky's even still <laughs> even still there. Is this a different downstairs? Or is this the same one from before with the dead guy? Oh, this is the other side. Okay. I have a nutcracker. We already dealt with the nut, though. Rusty and impossible to turn. This is for cracking open nuts. Uh. Okay. Well. Um. 
We got that. We got we got to find another nut. Yeah, apparently nuts play like a huge role in this game. Where's that other? Oh, my lights off for some reason. Uh, where was the other way we went down? Was it over here? Or is this just a different area altogether? Oh, this might be a different area altogether. Yeah, because that's the stairs I came down and then, uh... Oh, wait, maybe not. Is this where the dead guy is? Yeah, okay. Now I know where we're at. Alright, well. We got something new. I don't know how useful that is, but we have something new. Yeah, dude. Take a left at the dead guy and you'll find Chipotle. <laughs> find myself as a baby. Is this a different area? No, it's gonna take me back here, right? With the save? Yeah. Bro, what the fuck are we doing? I don't know if there's a map in this area, but it sucks that I missed it. And then there's the fucking getting hit by a train over and over again. There's like no enemies except for like two spots. Is this a map? Oh, thank God. Jeez, there's a God. Yeah, thanks. Oh, this is where I came from. Originally, this is where I came from, because I went past this uh, thing. Uh, the map I found is, like, like on the wall. Like, on the, like, in the wall, you know? I, you can't grab those. It's like, it's one of these. I think it's actually, like, where the trains go, not a map of the, uh, uh, of the station itself. Alright, now I can see all the locked doors. <laughs> I can see all the red lines. Alright. Uh, platform one, two, three. Well, it said Burgeon Street at platform three is where I need to go. Or, at least that's what she said. But, for the sake of looking, I'll, uh... Oh, wait, this is locked. Okay. Let me just make it official. Yes, okay. Yeah, okay. So let me go back to three. Oh. Oh, can I break this? A bolt and a nut. The nut is screwed on tight. Am I supposed to use my, my, my nut thingy? My nutcracker? Is that how that's supposed to work? I guess it was a different nut, chat. And this is just, uh... Oh, wait, this is... Oh, it's locked, okay. Alright, well, this is new. Oh, my good Christ. Thank God. So you don't even need to go to the, th the third thing. What? What? Bitch, why'd you lie to me? I wrote down Bergstrom and three and all that. You're gonna go fucking... Where am I? Hazel? I hate this fucking game. Oh, shotgun. Uh, birthday gift. Uh, I guess nobody would give me some this gross, but I'll take it anyway. It should come in handy. Cool. Well, maybe I'm not supposed to go this way. Maybe this is just with a shotgun. Uh, oh, shotgun shells in a blue case. That's so weird. I feel like shotguns are the... Uh, should always be green. Maybe because I'm used to Resident Evil. It's like when you, like, do your folders for, like, school subjects. 
You know, like red's always a specific color, blue and so on. Huh. Well, that wasn't there before. I'm just gonna go around it. Excuse me. He just he just woke up, didn't he? He just woke the fuck up. Chad, I can't take part in this conversation because I don't remember which one was which for me. Alright, at least I got the shotgun. Alright, we're still making progress. We're still moving and grooving. Alright, we have a college over there. Oh shit, maybe we actually do go to Burgeon. Maybe I spoke too soon. Oops. This is what divides chat. Oh, what folder went where? Yeah. Right, I know I'm supposed to go down three, but let me go down four. Oh boy. Anything here I can grab? Any grabbers in chat? I guess not. Oh, fuck me. Excuse me. Anything on this side? Mm, colossal waste of time! As per usual! Alright, we'll go down where we need to go. Oop. Yeah, dude. Okay. Chat, we might be finally out of this fucking subway. We've been here for like half an hour. This section probably takes like f five minutes if you know where you're going. Is that bait? Are we baiting right now? Am I gonna jump down and get hit by a ghost train again? No, that looks like the way. This time they're gonna mix it up. I'm gonna get hit by a fucking boat for some reason. Can't wait for this to be locked. Yep. Cool. Yep. Yep. How did I know? How did I know? I escaped, chat. Don't worry. I escaped. It was bait. I told you. I assume I had to run back to the, the, the platform. I have no idea. But, uh, yeah, I did. Okay, uh, anyone specifically or... At least the train's here now. I guess I need to go on the other side. I think I need to go on the other side. Okay. Woo! Lord. Lordy, lordy. You know how long it took me and my sisters to figure out you could climb the platform? I'm gonna be honest, I wasn't even sure if it would work. I just, uh, I panicked. Yeah, we need to get on platform four, I guess. Because everything is closed on this side. Ray's just that good? No, I was just mashing A in a panic, like, please. Will this work like I think it does? Because none of those doors are opening. Oh, there's more dogs over here. Okay, so... I wonder if I get on the train tracks now if I, like, just die. But okay. Hmm. Oh my god, please get away from me. No, the train's on the other side. I think I need to go back to, like, the other side of the third thing or something yeah dude i'm not going to jump back on the on the train but yeah none of those um none of the doors would open i'm going to check one more time just in case i miss something but the game is clunky yeah i mean it's a survival horror game from 2003 yeah okay i oh Glad I came back. S 
So, like, can I get on this fucking train? Oh my god, please get away from me. Where am I right now? Oh. Only tier three subs can get on the train? Apparently. Oh, you have to go lit all the way to the end. Jesus fucking Christ. What a fucking section. That was a nightmare. That was awful. Somehow running around in an empty city was made more sense than that to me. All right, done with the second area. Maybe. Hey, can I get a save? I don't want to go through all that again. What is this? There's a newspaper on the seat. Same old boring articles. All right. Oh, so that's right there from the floor. Oh, Christ. Oh, I always got to do this whole thing again, I guess, because I reloaded a thing. That's public transportation for you. Yeah, I guess, but you're usually able to, <laughs> able to ask somebody. Oh, hey, guys. Just a normal... Come on. Just a normal commute home. Hey, man, do you just want to, like, get around your dead... Oh, what the fuck's your problem? Oh, it only took three for some reason. All right. How's my health? Oh, my God, these fighting mechanics? Oh, they're all bad. Combat in Silent Hill is the worst. Is there going to be more up here? Or... Oh, this is an interesting visual effect. It's just like, I don't know how it hasn't gotten better across three games so far, right? Like, I really hope that's something they fix in the 2 remake. Oh, this one's a little bit bigger. Part of the reason I don't, I like, don't do combat in this game is, one, to like, preserve ammo and stuff because it's survival horror, but also because it's so bad. I try to avoid it at all costs. Can I... Can we... I'm just gonna go past you, thanks. Sorry for killing your dad or something. Remember my ammo in Sun Hill 1? Oh, yeah. Didn't I have, like, a fuck ton of ammo my first playthrough? Is that a first aid kit? Thank you. What is that? What do I like about Sign Hill? Generally, the, the story, the aesthetic, the mood, the music. Everything but the gameplay, really. What the fuck is this? Sign Hill 1, I couldn't stop thinking about. And Sign Hill 2, I played the Enhanced Edition, so a lot of stuff was fixed. But it was uh, one of the most depressing games I've ever played in my life. Uh, I should probably use my shotgun. But... Oh, he runs. Okay, well, we're going to use the shotgun now. They're making a new one. They're, uh, it's, they're remaking the second one. Oh, can you still kick in this? There we go. Kick him right in the nuts. Kick him right in his fat nut sack. Uh-oh. Kick him in the nuts. Yeah. That's my purse. I don't know you. Yeah. Oh, he's dead, but you can keep kicking him in the nuts. Okay. Oh, they are making the brand new one. That's right. I forgot they announced like, 
like three different Silent Hill games. Also, as far as combat mechanics, being able to kick an enemy is, is great. That's probably the best part. Anime Adam, thank you. Sturden, Hardy, uh, Dark T-Man, Cryptid Plays, Rachel Roth, thank you, everybody. <clears throat> All right. We out of here? Well, we might be. No conductor seat, huh? Yeah, I think we're good. Hey, a save. All right. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. Another safety save. Okay. Let's keep on trucking. You took yourself to see the Mario movie yesterday? Oh, the Mario movie is very good. Oh, this looks ominous. <clears throat> yeah, I'm still kind of sick. I'm still a little congested. Hmm. Okay. Rad. There's nothing I love more than this camera angle when I open a door and there's two enemies next to me. You don't have a movie theater to see Mario? That's right. It's supposed to come on to streaming in May, I think. Cool. <clears throat> Am I sicker than James' wife? I don't think so. Oh, there's like a thousand of you over there. All right. You know what? Uh, I have a feeling I have to run through here a lot, so let's just start. Let's back up a little bit. Oh, they dodged. Shut up. Where's the other guy? I guess it doesn't matter. I could dodge one better than I could dodge three. They can do that? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, for a PS2 game, this looks incredibly detailed. Like, I can't get over how good this game looks. So far, the game overall has been like, eh, but like, it looks incredible. Is this a fucking mace? Or a mall? What? Hank, same. Like a big, round, pointy hammer. <laughs> yep. It's super heavy, but at least it's got some oomph. Oh, isn't a mace, like, the one on the chain? Oh, that is a... That is a whole fucking swing. That's a flail. Oh. Well, first aid kit. This is... He's the one with the fucking purple lightsaber, I wish. Alright, well, we're on the lookout for... I was about to say. I feel like this room might have it. Oh, nice blood stain. Underpass map. Great. We're in the Grundle of Silent Hill. The swing starts all the way in Silent Hill 1. Yeah, no kidding.
I will say something that is spooky about this game, besides like the whole vibe, is not being able to see like into the dark and just hearing noises. Here we go. Hop! Yep. Stop dodging, you cuck. Oh my god, this is not as good as I thought it was going to be. We just save, so if I die, it's fine. Oh my god, this thing is way too slow. There's like four of you in here, huh? You really gotta get the timing down on that. For it to be useful. Are we back over here? Oh no, it's a completely new area. We go to the left, I guess. I like the conga line that we're making. That was great. Yeah, you know what? I think I might stick with the pipe. One of the bottles is empty. Got a wine bottle. Oh, beef jerky. Great. All right. Well, that seemed important. Let me, uh, let me heal here. Go back to that. I'm sure there's a way to use the mace and be, like, good, but that ain't me. Remember when I saved the big sword for the end of uh, Silent Hill 2? That was great. This bottle was dropped at a corner of the underground passage. Oh, that's it. Okay. Got some slower bosses at works. Oh, okay. Uh, let's go this way. Oh, that's cringe. Oh, actually. Shotgun? There we go. I forgot. You need to have the flashlight on. Don't trap me in here. Camera? Camera? Work with me. All right. There's way more rooms to check out over there, so let me go do that before we go to the right. I would love fixed angles for this. Pro yeah, a little bit. If you hold left trigger while you're running, it kind of keeps it in front of you, so that kind of works, but it's also uh, a little annoying. Okay. Oh, there's a guy right in front. Oh, that's a dead body. Uh, okay, yeah, we got some shit over here. These guys fucking own this underpass, dude. was that oh we're just back over here oh I don't know what I expected idiot there's another door over here though okay I don't know what I expected um I guess we can go this way and then down and all that shit. All right. Yeah, these guys do sound like donkeys. You're not wrong. They're the donkeys of the Silent Hill Underground. All right, so now we go to the left. It's just all Eeyore. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. So we haven't been here yet, right? No. All right, what demon do we have down here? Yep. Oh, is this the area I came from? No, this is a different one. All right.
Oh, I can't grab that bigger pipe, apparently. The spinning guys are very annoying. I don't even know how hard they are to fight. I just run past them with 99% of the enemies so far. All right, now it's just real fucking quiet. Great. Um, this is where I was before. Is this the right way? Yeah. I guess you can also go up, but... Look at this little door. Machine control room. Hmm. What kind of machine is this? It looks like it doesn't work anymore. I guess I'm going down. Huh. Is that fucking dookie? It's full of dirty water. I can't go down there like that. Ah, oh, chat. It's dookie. It's fucking straight up dookie water. How do I get over there, though? Oh, like this. Okay. I really gotta pee. Uh, this might be the fuel tank. There's nothing in it now, though. Oh, do I need to, like, put the fuel in the wine bottle as, like, the container and come back and put the fuel in there? Maybe. That way I don't have to go in the dookie water. Excuse me, buddy. Oh, and more stuff. Man, next boss I'm fighting is going to get fucked. Oh, a safe spot. Perfect. Um, I guess I should grab that, huh? Let me get more stuff over here. Thank God we're playing on normal. There's something scribbled all over the, the blackboard, but it faded. It's faded and hard to read. It doesn't look important anyway. Filled with junk. Filled with junk. Junkyard's in there? All right, what does this do? Uh, there's some kerosene left in this heater, looks like. If I had some sort of container, I could take it with me. Oh! It's a... Uh, just put the kerosene in the wine bottle. Cool. Hopefully that works as fuel. What's up, Eric, by the way? Alright, cool. Let me quickly, uh, run to the bathroom here, chat. And I'll be right back. Safety save. And now we'll be right back. Where's my mouse? Oh, there it is. We'll be right back a third time, I promise. All right, back to it. We got this kerosene. We could drink it, which could be a move, but... Let's head back. Excuse me, fellas. Chat, I don't know if you saw, but the, uh, the dev team or the mod team working on Luminescent Platinum the ROM hack I'm going to play in a couple of months uh, put out a new trailer and two cannon was in the trailer it was sick it made me so happy did you play the Majima Saga after I finished Kwame 2? yeah because it's only like an hour long if that and then go straight to three. Yeah, if you can change two cannons type, no, I think I mean it's you it's literally a two cannon or a two can rather. So I think normal flying is appropriate. Uh, thanks to that thing, all the water's finally drained out of the hole. It looks like I'll be able to get down there now if I could stand the smell. That is, guess we're going down. Jenny, thank you for the gifted sub. Oh, it's so fucking moist down here. Does my map work for down here? It does. Okay. Um, there was another path we can check. Let me go check that. I'm sure it's a dead end. Um, I should check that first, honestly. A shrug. Thank you for the six months. Yeah, I think the uh, the the luminous and platinum trailer was them saying that they're trying to go for uh, they're trying to add the whole national decks into the mod. So they showed off a bunch of other Pokemon. 
They show two cannon next to Dracovich of all things. You know, put two OP monsters next to each other, I get it. Alright, where the fuck am I? I'm over here now. Um, that's a dead end. Please stop. Uh, oh, is there anything over here? Uh, okay, I can't grab that. Okay, this is a fun room. I don't think there's anything in there besides two annoying enemies and Big Daddy. Alright. Uh, the mod I'm talking about is Pokemon Luminous and Platinum. Which is a ROM hack for BDSP. Will this be on YouTube? Yeah, tomorrow. Tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. Central. Ham dog, hello. How are you? Okay, staircase up there. Nothing. Interesting camera angle. All right, well. Guess something happens there. <clears throat> What's my schedule for games this week? Uh, no stream tomorrow. Tuesday is Stardew Season 6. We start that. Wednesday is Minecraft Legends. Thursday is no stream. Friday is Dead Island 2. Saturday is uh, Stardew again. And then Sunday is Sub-Sunday and it's po back to Pokemon Stadium. Okay, that's a small-ass path. I was going to play Advance Wars for Sub-Sunday, but then I realized I'd rather play Dead, um, uh, Pokemon Stadium again. What's up, Nate? <laughs> okay. Nah, no Battle Network. I'll be skipping Battle Network in Advance yeah, Wars. Dude. Now, can I get around this guy? Uh, okay. Or he can just hit me in the fucking face. He's gonna body block. You cuck. Alright, I need to, like, actually fight this thing. Uh, we'll just use the pistol, I guess. Humps, thank you. Thanks. Uh, sir. I I'm just, just need to get around you, S sir. Thank you. I guess he was still alive. Oh, I could have jumped in the water. Oh, you f you're dumb, Ray. You're dumb. I'll be honest. I was afraid I'm gonna jump in the water. A fucking train's gonna hit me, so I went the long way around. The same train from before. That was a waste of bullets and health. Anyway, let's keep looking. Alright, that's the door where we need to go. I'm gonna assume there's nothing on this side either. Oh, actually there is, okay. And this is the other side of that path where I got, where I thought I was stuck. Check it here first. At least I got to kick the thing. True. Okay, that's unfortunate. Excuse me, family. Good camera angle. Yep, thank you. Thank you. That's not even a door.
Uh, what do we got in here? Oh, some health, which is nice. A safe spot. Alright, we're making progress. Danger keep out. It's probably pasted on that door there. I can see where it fell off. Oh, good. Great. Law and Risen from Ashes. Thank you so much. What's up, Simon? Yeah, more Silent Hill. These hills do be making no noise. Oh. Do you have any hopes for the Silent Hill 2 remake? Uh, I don't know, because Bloober Team's making it, and it's kind of like, they make okay games. Honestly, if they make, like, the combat just usable, that would be an improvement. What the fuck is this? Do I just die here? Is this another insta-kill? What the fuck is with this game and insta-kill shit? What is this cheap garbage? What? Okay? I mean, there's a save spot right there. It's just random. I mean, I guess Silent Hill 1 had an insta-kill, right? If you didn't put something on the freezer door and you went to grab something, there was an insta-kill. And then I think there was something in two as well. Yeah. It's so bizarre. Like, that's just annoying. I guess we gotta go this way later first. Just, okay. Yeah, you know what? To its credit, it did say keep out. That's fair. It did say that. That's on me. Pyramid head, sword, insta-kills, no matter the difficulty. Yeah, but that's a boss. Also, that's like the enemy in Silent Hill 2. Oh, wait, this is where we came from. Oh, is that the thing down there? What the fuck is that? What? All right, well, there's something over here. Uh, a dryer? Okay. There's something right... Oh, that's the, uh, the butt plug looking thing. Someone threw a wheelchair out. All right. Bunch of trash. Can't turn this light on? Sure can't. Little known fact, the Silent Hill team was made up of former Sierra devs. True. I found it in a sort of garbage dump. Still usable, though. Huh. I don't even know where the fuck we would use this. I'm trying to think of things we've, we've seen. Well, that might have been a waste. I don't think I needed both of those. Oh, he's not there now. Oh, man. Do I use the hair dryer on the tentacle monster? I mean, there's like nowhere else to go. I don't know how that would make sense, but... Whoops. At this point, I'm willing to try anything. Okay, yeah, there's the one open door over here. Yeah, I doubt this is going to do anything, but, I mean, <laughs> we'll check. Is there a plug I can plug it in? Who's ready to watch me die to hentai again? Alright, hold on. 
It's a crank dryer. There's an outlet here. You gotta be fucking kidding me. You... There's no way. Uh... Am I gonna throw it in the water to kill it? Okay. Are we, are we 100% sure that these aren't Sierra devs? Like, I know that was a joke, but... Are we sure? Also, I'm pretty sure that wasn't that big of a hairdryer. I feel like the hentai would be... Stronger. I don't... Alright, well... We're moving. We're moving and grooving. I can't believe that worked. The drum is in the way. There's something inside, I doubt. I can move it. Yeah, also the cord didn't look that long. It's four times a week to water. Oh, is the hentai monster electric flying? I'm sorry, a water flying? Um... Yeah, all right. And Heather's an electric type, so it's stab. Ah, I see. Oh, dude, these enemies? Yo, sick! Audio design is my passion. Okay, yep. Oh, don't block the path. All right, well, that kind of worked out. What should that do? Ah, uh, not too much. <clears throat> okay. I feel like this game doesn't have that many puzzles. We've been playing for two and a half hours and we only did... Excuse me, we only did one? I guess we could still be early on, to be fair. <coughs> Unless you want to count, like, the item combination stuff puzzles. I'm talking about more like the Shakespeare thing from earlier. But I guess you could consider the hairdryer thing like a puzzle. Oh, up through a hole. I felt like the whole fucking subway station was a puzzle, I guess, to be fair. Wooden crate. Wait, what did that say? I don't think I can get this open. All right. Not a melt your pube hair to wax to make it look like... Or, oh, yeah, from Sign Hill 2? God. Not only was that the puzzle, but the thing you need to open is on the floor. I was looking for a door, like... Hello? I was looking for a door forever, but it's a goddamn hatch. That was a safe spot right there, sure. The horse wax handle is still my favorite. That's definitely uh, my favorite so far. Favorite being like, you know, most annoying, if that makes any sense. But I don't know, this, this hair dryer one was kind of out there. Oh, here we go. All right, everyone, look for a map. Everyone band together and look for a piece of paper that I can use as a crutch. A lot of health strings, that's concerning. Maybe I don't need a map. Maybe it's only like these couple of rooms. <clears throat> what about the hook and hair piece to get the key in two? Oh, yeah, that was kind of wacky. That was kind of wacky tobacco. The Little Mermaid music box was just because I missed it. I didn't see James turn his head. Okay. 
That was because I didn't see James turn his head. And I wasted like 30 minutes because of it. Warning, the third level ceiling has crumbled. For safety's sake, entries forbidden. Okay. Good. Toolbox. For the, the fourth level has crumbled. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. Thirty minutes of wasted looking for a hatch on the floor. Yeah. That's like my specialty. Just wasting too much time on an item I missed. It's a toilet. I thought this building was still under construction, but it still looks like it's been used. The fuck is that noise? What's that camera angle, by the way? Am I looking to see if there's a log in the toilet? Any turds? <laughs> yeah, any turds in chat? Hey, Soul, thank you for the five gifted subs. Handgun bullets. You are my dad. More gifted subs. Dad. Thank you. Wookie, wookie, wookie. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Apparently this is the floor for all the gifted subs. Oh, God. Camera. I can't see the fourth level floor. It's too dangerous to jump down there. Is it? Because I kind of want to do it. Uh, is this just a hammock? Oh, yeah, a little squatters living here. Just fucking Heather, please. Please. Hey, Ray, just hit a million gamer score today with the RE3 remake. Hell yeah. Congrats, and thank you for the 28 months. I think I have a highlight for RE3 remake scheduled kind of soon-ish. What the fuck? The wall color looks a little different here, and the material is different, too. Might break if I hit it hard enough. Uh, well, let's see if it's literally hit it hard enough. Shisha! Hmm. Shisha again! Okay, we need an item. I do like the little pedestrian donk noise. Or maybe it has to be like, is it like the other attack? Yeah. I can't do the overhead. That's a dead body. Hey, gamers. You have to do... You have to tap A. You can't do the overhead. You have to do the, the baby move. A silencer. Or maybe it was rule of three. Who knows? Put it on a handgun or a submachine gun to muffle the blasts. Uh, I guess I just have it now, huh? Was that all that was for? I think I'll just leave it alone. There's nothing I can do now. Okay. Yeah, can I put a silencer on this big-ass thing? Um, are there any other walls like that? I guess not. Hmm. Why was there a body in there? Uh, you know, why not? Oh, I gotta drop this into the hole first. I guess I make sense. <laughs> it's Jimmy Hoffa. Um, all right, go get myself the pipe again, I guess. Ah! I thought the wall was story related, but I guess I was just a little hidden silencer. Game over. Yeah, you know, I'm surprised. Oh, I can go through this? I'll go through it later. Okay. I was literally just in this fucking room. What do you mean? Excuse me. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Well, I only have one way to go, so I guess I'll just... See ya. Oh, you just wanna go take a nap again. 
Okay, this is gonna be annoying. Uh, I think I actually do need to kill these guys. Is Tub still in here? Oh, he's right there. He doesn't get aggroed, I guess. Um. All right, let me use the shotgun here. Yep. Or maybe I don't need to because they left me alone. And I went the wrong way. Fuck you. He's still alive. He's still alive. Okay. I don't know which one's alive. They're both... Is my shotgun just filled with, like, prayer? Does it not do damage? Are we for real? What is the point? I'm in hell right now. I'm in hell. This is great. This is... This is... This is pod racing, dude. This is... This is great. This is peak. This is peak gameplay. Okay. All because I went the wrong way, huh? Yep. Nice. Alright, well. I don't think my shotgun works. It did work against the fat guy, though. going on in here got a door over there mannequin catalog all right well now we're in a building all right as per usual everyone look for a map I think I turned around. Is this where I came from? Oh, no, no, no. This is a different area, I think. Oh, good. Mannequins. Perfect. Have I played Silent Hill 4? No. The only Silent Hill game I played before I started streaming was Homecoming. And I thought that was just uh, okay. I played for easy achievements. What? This? This is blood. Well, nothing gets past you, Heather. Uh. Well, I guess it's time to leave this room. See ya. I can't believe I killed the mannequin. Yeah, me neither. I don't even know what I did. Oh, not the dogs again. My arch nemesis. Uh, I can't fit in. I'm too dummy thick. Over, over here. All right. <clears throat> oh, uh, well, I guess I'll go down. All right. Well, I keep, I guess I'll keep going down. The, the camera seems amazing and not disorienting at all. Oh, yeah, they really had it all figured out in 2003. Okay, we gotta go up. Maybe fixed camera angles aren't so bad. You know? Fifth floor. All right. Kind of sign, kind of the same room layout.
All right, that door's just locked. It doesn't say like the lock is broken. It just says it's locked. Okay, so fifth floor, auto part, office or some shit. All right, so. What the fuck is that noise? Are you for real? This what? What are, are you? All right. Well, I mean, I need to kill him because I don't know if there's anything in here. All right. Kicked in the nards. Uh, how dare you? Oh, he has a wake up attack. Cool. Didn't have that last time. Is there literally nothing in here? Was there no point to any of that besides wasting ammo and health? I hate this fucking game. Cool. Cool. Oh, you're... You, you leave, like, bloody footprints. That's kind of cool. I have to go to supplies. Alright, well, keep looking. Hey, guys. Alright, can we get a map in here? Oh. Got a jack. Oh, I wonder if that's for the elevator. To, like, um, open the door further. I realize you could adjust the volume of this. That's cool. You can use this to raise a car when you need to change a tire or something. All right, no map, but we got a jack, I guess. Let me uh, unequip the shotgun here. Oh, that's nice, actually. Okay, so that's that one. So we just want a big circle. I don't think I went in here. Its title is Repressor of Memories. What the hell kind of title is that? I don't get this picture at all. Heather, it's art. Hmm. Screwdriver. Okay. Interesting angle. A, ka a katana? What? This is a short katana, about two feet long. Pretty powerful and easy to handle. Um. <sighs> yeah, dude. Oh, can, wait, can you fucking block? How long have you been able to fucking block? Alright, well, we got a katana now. I guess blocking really wouldn't benefit me too much since I'm running past, like, 99% of the enemies, but... This seems like it might be the best, uh... Melee weapon, or at least one of the better ones. Can I not... I guess that's not a door. All right. Okay. Now, this is a calm, relaxing picture. Mountain. Nice and simple. All right. Ceramic pot. Guest registration. Ignored for now. Still no map, huh? All right. 
Uh, I call Chisel. Sorry, it isn't much. Want to say I've been watching your Pokemon ships VODs, and I've learned a lot. Be uh, I've learned a lot and become a Pokemon fan thanks to you. Oh yeah, hell yeah, man. Thank you. You don't have to apologize. Five dollars is more than enough. Appreciate it. I'm glad you've learned some Pokemon watching me. I don't know everything about Pokemon, but I know an okay amount. It gets me by. I know a little about competitive. Uh, okay. Let's go back down, I guess, to see if we can open that elevator. <clears throat> Actually, how much higher can we go? Ah, okay. How's the spooky meter so far? Uh, uh, probably like a two out of five, three out of five. More annoying than spooky. Gen. Because Ambipom is not in Gen 9. Oh! The door downstairs looks open, too. No way I can get down there like this. Okay, but what if I use the screwdriver? Fuck. Gotta, gotta find another mattress. Did I go inside here, the dance studio? I don't think so. Map? Oh, thank God. Thank God! Now I can really start exploring. All right, let's save. I feel like Ambipom is probably like a UU or RU Pokemon in most uh, games it's in. I feel like it could do a pretty decent chunk of damage. I think it's kind of fast, has stab uh, fake out. Okay, let's see here. Yep. Another hanger? Can I use it? Nope. Oh, I didn't even see that the butt plug there. That was useful. Glad I came back to check. Uh, yeah, I think these are just heels in here. I'm back. Welcome back. We are in the uh, Hilltop Center. No idea where that is in the grand scheme of things, but... Oh, uh, absolutely not. Okay. Is there anything in here? I did just save so we can get a little uh, fast and loose. I don't think there's anything here but three enemies. Uh, do another look, look around. I don't think so. Okay. So don't go in there. Hey, thank you for that store order. Framerate merch. Dot com. All right, law firm we haven't been in. And we will continue not to be in. Uh, okay, so and we've been everywhere in the storefront. I think that's where we came in from, the storefront. Uh, all right, so let's go. I guess let's go check the other floors. I don't know what we need the screwdriver for yet. I don't think we found what we need it. Um, but if we go back to the fifth floor, we'll check there. All right. 
You bet it's used to drive screws. Uh, oh, there's some more doors over there I haven't been into. Okay. Need more walnuts. <clears throat> Is it this way? No, right. Nope. Why would you? Yep. Yep. <clears throat> I guess I explored everything over here. Unless I did miss something with the screwdriver. Oh, right, this fucking room. Yeah, this was the the nothing burger. Yeah, what if I can use the screwdriver to open up a door? Probably not, but. Chera, an MD. Thank you guys for the resubs. Is there anything in the Gallery of Fine Arts? Anything I can use like a screwdriver for? Looks like there was a picture here before. Only the caption's still around. Flame purifies all. Flame, eh? But I don't know what kind of picture used to be here. But I'm not too fond of fire. It's scary somehow. All right, well, I guess if we find fire... We might be able to do something with that. Just light all the pictures on fire. Did I do it? Hmm. Okay, yeah, there's nothing over here because this is where we got the uh, katana, right? All right. Uh, I used the jack already. And uh, it was what I thought it was for to open up the elevator door on the third floor. To reveal that the elevator door for the fourth floor is open, but we have no way to climb down. And the only other item I have is a screwdriver, so I'm trying to figure out where to use it. I'm going to check the, uh, the other floors again, like the sixth floor door. See if there's anything I missed. Check the fourth floor door as well. Yep, lock's broken. What else is new? Do, 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 do. Hmm. Okay, so that's nothing. Third floor is where we hang out. Check the second floor. Yep, it's broken. Knowing this game is some random square you pass six times or something? Yeah. I didn't I didn't see Heather's uh, head move. No, I'm paying the price. Okay, so it's only the third floor and the fifth floor we have access to. And yet again, there's nothing down here. So, all right, I guess we'll go back to the third floor. everything here there's like no door over here right nope the one door that was locked but not broken we went through already on the fifth floor I think if we're talking about the same one hmm yeah and the screw doesn't do anything I guess that lock just stays there or the jack stays there oh wait did I go into this door okay good Hey, it's locked. Um, I don't have access to any other floor. The red line you see, I think, is like the door you go through. You would go through. But if it's down one, it would be the second floor. I mean, there could be something in the dance studio. I just don't know what it would be. Because there's like so many enemies in there. And I just don't want to waste ammo for no reason. Let me check this area again. Oh, 
was the mannequin room. Yeah, does anything happen, like, with this? Like, I don't I assume the screwdriver doesn't do anything. No, the enemies don't drop stuff. Yeah, these are just mannequins and shit. Hello, Crazy8, how are you? Creepy-ass mannequin room with a bleeding head. And then this is where I came in from with the window. I guess I could go back out. I don't know if there's any reason to, but I could. You know what? I take it back. There's no reason to go out there. Those enemies respawned. Mannequin catalog. And then just a thermos. And I can't go in that other corner. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I found a katana. I haven't really used it yet. But, uh, I have it. Yeah, the only thing that I can think of is to try the, the dance studio, but I did just fucking, like, dogs in there, and then the fat guy in there, and it just seems like a big ammo dump. But there is a save spot right there, so maybe I can just save, uh, clear it out, see if there's anything in there, and, and that's that, which might be the play. Let me go all the way back down here again one more time. Camera. Oh, went too far. Oh, yeah, the locker room. We got some stuff in here. It's just heels, magazines. Hmm. It's the next door. Fuck me. <clears throat> All right, save spot. And then a bunch of just random, random bullshit, it looks like. Oh, can I open this drawer? There's a rope. Drawers open just a smidge. It must be... Yep. I'm glad I came back. You got to use a screwdriver to open this to get the rope. I didn't even notice that this was slightly ajar. All right, cool. Uh, we'll still save because we're right here, but now we can... Thank God that prevented us from going back in that room and wasting like five minutes. All right, well, let's keep going. We're still on the third floor, right? Uh, yeah, we are. Cool. Oh, wait, which door is it? It is the... This one. This seems dangerous. I used the rope. What are you, like, what are you tying the rope to? Eh, it doesn't matter. It's, she just jumps down the shaft holding the rope. Oh, fuck. Oh, safe spot right there, huh? You know what? It's going to take two seconds. Just save again. Second floor hall. Surprised that wasn't an insta-kill, yeah. The game's like, oh, you didn't tie the rope to anything, you die. I assume the elevators are both fucked, yep. You think they got seven up in that machine? Nah, man, just DNL. No RC Cola. Is RC Cola like the first choice uh, for anybody? Like, I don't mind RC Cola, but I would still rather like a Coke or like a Pepsi, right? But RC Cola is like the third option. Oh, great. More jerky. We move. He's more of that. Oh, what is this? 
Just use for display. I can't really be used. Oh, I can't take a dump in here? Damn. Coke, Dr. Pepper, then Pepsi. My go-to soda, if I'm going to have soda, is Dr. Pepper, and then Coke would be uh, would be second. Or Pepsi, whatever that the, the alternative is. Should I plug the drain? Is something going to come out? Oh, I knew it. Oh, we're going to hell. We're going to the nightmare world. Oh, ew. Is this an insta-kill? Did I just die? You died from a headache. It's being invaded by the other world. By a world of someone's nightmarish delusions come to life. Oh, the floor is still, like, moving and shit. Was that dad? Was that Harry? Harry Mason? Bacon. Thank you for the seven. No, not again. Did she do this too? Is she, is she blaming Claudia for that? I'm about to bust. Hey, thank you for the sorter. Framerate.merch.com. I feel like that would have hurt my foot. Geez, someone bought a lot of stickers. The order's still going. Oh. Uh. Don't like that. Oh. Thanks for the handgun bullets. Handicap doll thing. Oh, thank God. My fucking map still works. There's a god. Oh, Jesus fucking, what the hell was that? Thought that was a liquor. What are these camera angles, dude? What does that say? Find the holy one or or. Find the holy or, like diamond? Kill her. Thanks. Oh, that's me. Who could have taken this photo? That's really creepy. Also, it is kind of funny, Greg Miller, that I thought that enemy was a liquor, and then we go into the next room and there's an herb. <clears throat> Frank West took that picture. Oh! Cutscene. Heather, that's what you're called now, isn't it? And who are you? The name's Vincent. Don't forget it, okay? Or is it Ark? I'm on your side. Uh, so you say. But how do I know you're not with her? Her? <coughs> you mean Claudia? Please don't lump me together with her. She was totally brainwashed by that crazy old hag. I guess crazy old hag is a bit harsh. She is your mother, after all. True. My mother? True. Don't remember? Uh, so Harry didn't do anything. Harry. I guess he hid the truth to keep you on his side. Hey, that figures. He's a pretty sneaky guy. Don't talk about my dad like that! Sorry. I apologize. Please. Calm down. How do you know my father anyway? I know everything. 
Oh, everything ever? I know about your past, too. Then tell me what's going on. You don't know even that? You were a Chipotle That's burrito, dude. Asking. If you know everything, then tell me how I can put an end to this. Not yet. Why not enjoy yourself a bit longer? Enjoy? I feel like I'm going crazy. Doesn't this place get to you at all? Oh, it gets to me all right. I find it most fascinating. Wait, I'm not finished talking. <laughs> She's had enough. I knew you were on her side. How do you figure? There's something wrong with you too. All right, so uh, that was Vincent. All right. That's a lot of fucking health. It's a junior high school chemistry book here. When you pour diluted hydrogen peroxide onto uh, manganese dioxide, oxygen is produced. Although oxygen will not burn on its own, it will help other things burn. All right, you guys write that down? Did you guys get that? We got to do chemistry or some shit. <clears throat> Oxidol. Use this to disinfect cuts and stuff. It foams when you put it on. Something, something, mixed chemicals. Got it. This is how we defend, uh, defeat plant 42. Alright. Gotta remember, there's a liquor out here. Okay, it knocked me down immediately. Okay. Yep, of course. Why wouldn't it be? Oh, I can get in the elevator? Uh, Alright. That was more of a panic mash the A button until I get in. Okay. Uh. Oh. Uh. Guess we'll go down a floor. <clears throat> What the fuck is that? If I grab that book, am I gonna die? Oh, one way to find out. I'll take the bait. I can't read the book. I'm gonna leave you there. Actually, see you later. Anyway. <clears throat> it's his book. Just him in here. Pork liver. Oh, he's got shotgun shells behind him. That could be useful. Alright, I got it. This was in the cafe's fridge. Gotta do something with it before it goes bad. Uh, we, we combine it with that. Shit. Grab this while he does his whole animation. Yep, I guess so. Anyone want some liver? Some pork liver? Do you think this thing wants some pork liver? Use the silencer on the pork. You'll never hear it coming. on the second floor, so, like, I think there's more to explore on this floor. I just kind of ran here immediately. Oh, 
Hey guys, excuse me. I'm just just trying to explore a little bit. Excuse me, fellas. Yep. Any doors over here? Nope. Just another elevator. Okay. Yep. And all right, that's been fun. I'll see you guys later. So the third floor, huh? How are we feeling about the third floor? Because I think that's everything, right? Uh, I can't go in the men's bathroom, but I think that's. Oh, there's more over there. All right. Oh, open up. <clears throat> All right. Make a left, left, right. Left. Left. I need to go right. Are these both locked? Of course. I think I went the wrong way. Oh, it doesn't matter. It was locked. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. I was here. Um, yeah, I think that's all the doors here. Yeah, okay. We're good to go to the uh, elevator now for realsies. We got some got got some goddamn baby jump scares. All right, so going up. Maybe we're not going up. All right, fuck you, floor three. Babies are jump scares. IRL too. True. A bulletin board's falling down here. Something useful written on it. Oh, Jesus. There's a hole. Hello, Jesse. Okay, that's locked. So I might need a key. Oh. Nice. Nice. Also locked. That's the whole area, huh? All right, a lot, a lot happened on the third, on the fourth floor. Just two locked doors, and uh, I'm guessing I can't go down here. All right, well, to the fifth floor, I guess. Am I having fun? I am having fun. Game's growing on me a little bit. But so far, as of right now, it's still my least favorite, I'd say. Of the three I've played. sound great. Yep. Why? What am I looking at here? Oh! This fucking pig thing. That's a glass wall. Oh, this is the art room. There's a caption under this picture, flame purifies all. Oh, I've seen this picture before. Yeah, this is this is the other picture. Do I like put this in there? Do I combine it with this? I think this is going to produce oxygen. But what is oxygen good on its own? Oh, I need to like burn this. I think. I guess I, I think I'm missing an item. I think I need more than the uh, <laughs> than the pork and the the other thing. 
All right, that seems uh, that seems important. I feel like we're missing an item though. Hold on, let me just save. Ah, the mental clinic. Great. You gotta burn the evidence you were there. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Evie Lucians, what's going on? I set myself on fire. That's the solution. Uh, can I, like, look at the bucket? I don't want to look at the... Is there anything in the bucket? Hmm. Hmm. All right, yeah, there's something with that. I don't know if I'm missing something, but... It prioritizes the picture instead of the bucket. Shout out to our friend, uh, returning friend, the bucket. From when we made the uh, insecticide, or whatever it is we made. Did that go in here? Uh, I sure did. There's more doors on the other side that might be open. Fuck off. Yeah, I accidentally made mustard gas. You know, as, as you do. Okay. Um. Sure. Handgun, handgun. Ah! These matches? There it is. There it is. Okay. Cool. Raise ancient? What do you mean? I'm only going to be 34 in a few months. Sometimes I wake up and I feel dusty. So that's fair. Whoops. There we go. <clears throat> Science, bitch! Oh, am I climbing? Oh, I cl- Oh, what? Are the- Are those ears? Where- Where am I? Oh, there's a staircase. What are these papers? The priestess accepted the king's request and went to the village gates, but when she saw the monster, she tried to convince it with words instead of killing it. Shut up, you. I'm going to eat you up. The monster didn't listen to a word the priestess, priestess said. They say princess? Priestess. Uh, but you kept trying to convince the monster to give up. It's wrong to eat people, you know. The monster grew very angry at this and attacked her, killing her with a single mighty blow. Well, no beginning, no ending. I really didn't understand that story. It's probably just some pages torn from the middle of a book. Hmm. That's a good noise. Hey, fella. I'm gonna go around you, thanks. Okay. I love checking a door and being open for a hit. That's so good. Okay, that's open. Oh, hey. Is this a trap? Yep. 
You want to dance, pussy? I studied the blade. Okay. I know it's on the ground, Heather, but can we, like, I don't know, like... There we go. Okay, this is not really working out great. Uh... Shusha! 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 Did I get it? Oh, that actually did a good amount of damage. It's just hitting it was a nightmare. Alright. Sure, man. Take that. Yeah, those enemies suck because they're um they're fast and they're on the uh on the ground. Okay, right. I still have this I'm dealing with. Uh everything looks the same. Four four of these guys in here, huh? Fucking four of these guys? Oh, this is great. This is so good. Excuse me. A new area, yeah, it is. Where's this lead? Oh, it leads back over here. Okay, and this leads me back to, to exactly where I think it is, right? Yeah. Alright, let's keep looking around. You hear five guys only gives one fry per bag? Then you are, then you are mistaken. Ooh, a silver coin. Don't need any more coins. Standard coins and bills. Of course, like money might not come in handy. Goes without saying, it would be nice to have. I think I'll pass them anyway. Oh. Kind of thirsty, sure. Joe Biden voice. Soda! It's an insta-kill. Yeah, the fucking the thing falls on me. Ooh, a key. A life insurance key. Jesus. Wait, what does this say? There's something written on the wall. Thus one's life turns to riches. What was a bag of silver coins is now the number in a book, yet fate hath no price. Ah, but do people know this? I don't, what the fuck are you saying? What? Shut up. I bought this from the vending machine. It looks it looks real enough. There's a tag on the key that says Elberton Life Insurance. Oh shit, 98 more! 98 more in an hour of Minecraft. Let's go. Thanks for trying this series. I had a great time with it. I've had a great time with the the series as a whole. I think I just like one and two more so far. Um I guess I just make my way back to the elevator. Oh! Oh, three looks well. Three looks a lot better overall, but we played the enhanced edition of two, and that that looked amazing. Five, right? Well, oh no, we were on four, but we've been to five, right? The picture, I climbed through all that shit. <clears throat> um, I can't go to six. I think I can't go to three, and oh, monster. 
Oh, the life insurance thing is down there. Okay, we got to go to the first floor. It looks like. I have no idea what that monster is, but it's probably something. Do I have any, like, items for it? Uh, I don't think so. No. Okay. I'm kind of afraid to, like, walk up and touch it. Oh. Of course not. I think they're distracted by jerky. Okay. Uh, the fuck? Oh, right there. This is the end of that crappy fairy tale I found. The king and his people shed tears at the death of the kind priestess. God took pity upon them and granted their wishes, healed the priestess. The priestess opened her eyes just as she had done every morning of her life. She went once more to the monster's lair. Fool, you wish to die again. No, this time it's your turn. The priestess had come to defeat the monster once and for all. As the priestess was very, very kind, she felt sad about this task, but it had to be done. Swords and spears won't work. Arrows and bullets will just bounce off. You can't kill me, the monster laughed. But the priestess used neither sword nor spear. She chanted but a single spell. Tu fui ego eris. Do you know what happened then? The monster let out a huge cry and then died and vanished. Thus, the villagers were able to use their gates once more. Everyone lavished their gratitude upon the priestess, and they all lived happily ever after. Am I supposed to do that in the monster? That's like right there. Fui, ego, Eris. Weird writing. What was that? Hmm. I don't know. I know a big scary monster though that's hanging out. Oh. I guess the guys are are gone. Ooh, spooky. Oh, those are locked. Oh wait, there's another door over here. Never mind. My spell, uh, kill them all? Oh shit, it did. I didn't really chant it, I just read it. Also, I'm glad we just got flashbanged here, apparently. Oh. Oh, great, on the map. Wonderful. Uh. What's over here? Hmm. Uh. Daisy Villa Apartments. Oh! I live there. At least I have a key for that area. Don't know why I did that. Sorry. Did a 540. Before we check over there, um, let me see if there's anything else over here. Negative. I'm about halfway through the game now. Okay. I'm making some pretty decent time. We were really struggling in the beginning with the, um, the mall and especially the subway station, but I think we're making some okay time now. Only fought one boss so far. <clears throat> if 
feel like I've probably missed a bunch of shit, but that's fine. Like, I don't know if I missed a weapon. It's been a while since we... I guess we did get the katana kind of recently, but who knows. Um, nope. This way. Thank you. Oh. What was my key? 102. Okay. <laughs> there was some minigun you missed. Fuck. Uh, 103. Elevator. That is not an apartment. It's over here. But this is my place. Why should I leave the apartment? Wait, what? I'm confused. Okay, anyway. You totally missed the lightsaber? Can't you unlock a lightsaber if you, uh, get, like, the best rating or some shit? Fried Fox, a thousand oh. bits. You'll need it. I'll always need bits. Dad, I'm home. Listen, something really crazy is going on. I think we should... Dad? Harry? Harry Mason? Dad? Harry? No! Harry Mason is dead! No! Not Harry! Not his thick ass! Ah, oh, rip Harry. Ripped ya. No! 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 Sag. Rest in peace to the great Dumpy that was Harry Mason. Rest in peace. Can I get an RNJR Sag in chat, please? Thank you. Please and thank you. F, dude. F. Stock noise for running on metal. Did you do this? Hi, Claudia. You're late. But why? I got stuck in the subway. Why? I don't want to talk about it. I got hit by four trains. For 17 years ago, for one thing. <clears throat> if not for him, our dream would have come true. And then took you away from us. I'll get you for this! Oh, that was threatening. There is another reason. To fill your heart with hatred. Oh, you can turn me to a heartless? It must be this way. One day you'll understand why. No, I'll never understand! How far am I? Someone said about halfway. You must try to remember your true self as well. You will yeah, go to God dude. and build an eternal paradise. Huh. What's up, Tanner? He's the one who killed your father. I merely gave the order. So... What will you do? What the fuck is that? I'll be waiting where all begins. In the town of Silent Hill. Credits! Uh... Okay. Oh! It doesn't look like- it doesn't sound like I can hit the front. Oh my god, can the camera, like, actually work?
Do I have to, like, shoot it in the back, maybe? Um... Oh, it's absolutely what you need to do. Uh, uh. While it's on the ground, can I switch to the blade? I might just stick to shotgunning it over and over again. This boss is great with this phenomenal camera. Oh, oh, yep. Okay. Yep. That was God damn it. Now this is boss music. I have a plan. Hold on. Where's the big daddy? Here it is. Ah! Oh boy. Yep, okay, that thing still sucks. That thing still sucks penis. If I started uh, charging it up yesterday, maybe I would've hit it. Uh, let me just do a quick heal here. worth, like, kicking it while it's down, because I could get... Uh, what if I should shoot with a pistol, maybe? Wait. Oh, okay. I thought it was... We were done. Like, would it benefit to do this? Oh, I, oh he's dead. Oh, okay. I think? He's bleeding. Okay, well, one more kick to the nuts to make sure. All right, well, that was uh, a fight. It was more difficult than the first fight. I give it that. I don't know what the fuck the music was. It was like someone went to a goddamn construction site and held up a recorder. I don't know what to say. Hey, Douglas. Don't say anything. I'm fine, so just get out of here and leave me alone already. Calm down. I just... Calm down? How am I supposed to do that? My father is dead. He's murdered. Get out. This is all your fault. Well, you didn't kill my dad. If it were for you. I'm sorry. Then go. If it make you feel better... Is he okay like this? Well, he's dead, so it doesn't matter. What else can I do? There's no one here to give him a decent burial. Who killed my dad? Fucking Edward Katana hands upstairs on the roof who we just killed. <sighs> Credits. What's in Silent Hill? I don't know. Do you think it's safe? Of course it isn't. I don't know what kind of hell is waiting for me there, but I've got no other choice. I don't care about God or paradise. If that's what she believes, then fine. <coughs> But she won't get away with what she did. When I find her, 
I'll kill her myself. Oh shit. Revenge doesn't solve anything. Maybe not, but that's what I'm going to do. How do you get there? None of your business. I'll give you a ride. I don't need your help. Yeah, but it's too far to walk. Besides, I'm partly responsible for this. I'll bring the car around back. Come by and we'll finish saying goodbye. How old is she supposed to be? Heather 17. You know, you might die too. That's fine. Nobody's gonna cry over my grave. Jesus. God damn, alright. Woo! Douglas, you are right, man. Getting a little, a little sad there. I went in the ammo front. 124, 20. Okay, sounds about right. Let me just get myself back to my katana. I'll find that woman and make her pay. I promise I will. Sorry, Dad. What, what is this bird's eye view on the bathroom? Am, are we looking for turds again? Dad, no turds before you died? Nothing to eat. It's a hidden camera. Is it a glory hole like in uh, Silent Hill 4? Is it prepping me for Silent Hill 4? Monsters in the toilet. Is there more to explore? Oh yeah, can I go to my room? That's a good point. Uh, this is my dad's room, right? Yeah, or er, where he's buried, right? The fat shit room. Oh hell yeah, a stun gun, stun gun batteries. Wait, what? High voltage to zap the bad guys. It has a, it has to touch them though, so it's very short range. Oh, hmm. No fat shits for me either. I don't remember exactly when, but I think I got this doll at the garage sale. I still like it, but there's nothing I can do with it right now. Not much happening here. Morning always comes. It's corny, but it's true. But if you're Eyes are closed. It always feels like night. That's the hero's line from this movie. I always liked that line, but now it just seems so stupid. All right. Well, we got a stun gun. Have I ever been hit by a stun gun before? No. I assume it knocked me on my ass, though. met some guy named Vincent. Ooh, I'm Vincent? Vincent? He's a friend of yours, right? Well, no. Wouldn't say that. I'm not sure. He said when we get to Silent Hill to look for a guy named Leonard. Leonard? He gave me this map. Oh my god, he gave you the map? What a god. What do you want to do? We can't trust him, but we've got no other choice. Here, take this too. What's this? Your father was holding it. Simple works to my dear daughter. Mm. Print screens, I give her the four years.
started raining. Who? Are you sleeping? I'm awake. Cold? What's the deal with Silent Hill anyway? It used to be a nice, quiet little town. But now... You've been there? Once, on a missing persons case. Never did find him. Good. But I'll tell you, that's one screwed up town. My line of work, you hear a lot of nasty rumors. I was born and raised there. Sorry. I didn't mean to offend you. No offense taken. Anyway, I thought you grew up in Portland. What's wrong? Feeling sick? My head's pounding like the worst hangover ever. Maybe your car sick. No. I'm just trying to remember. My childhood. Something terrible happened in Silent Hill 17 years ago. Boy, it sure did. I got a I got the bad ending. Is what happened. <laughs> she tried to summon the ancient god. It was all a dream. She offered up her very own daughter. Yeah, she's like my so, but it worked. uh half sister, maybe. I don't know how does that work. Girl gave birth to a god. Huh? You see, that girl had special powers. Powers? Her classmates called her a witch. She could make things happen with her mind. <coughs> could kill people just by wishing for it. So is the missing person Doug was looking for looking for or was it is it implied supposed to be James? In the end that god was killed by a single person. My father, Harry Mason. Oh, it's oh, it's okay. You'll find out. I guess it wasn't much of a god if it could be killed by a human being. Yeah, but you see Harry's ass? He could stop anybody. Guys, my Harry Mason impression. You ready? Claudia's trying to do the same thing again. And I'm gonna swing gonna this axe. Advice. You've got some kind of power in you too. After the god was killed. That's it. The girl reappeared. She was holding a baby in her arms. Before she died, she gave the baby to my father. I'm the baby. Guess a nice little recap of Silent Hill 1 if you never played it. Just like I was his very own daughter. Even though he didn't know who or what I was. So sudden. I never had a chance to tell you, to tell you how happy you made me. Oh man, now I feel bad. Like someone tried to draw Ashley from memory. This game came out first. This game came out in 2003. Resident Evil 4 was 2005? So. Resident Evil 4 copied this. It's that easy. 
Somebody head for that Leonard guy's house. You check out the hospital. Oh, all right. Got the map, right? Yeah. I do. Gonna be okay alone? I'm not a child, you know. Well, you're 17, so you kind of. Are you sure it's not you who's afraid to be alone? <sighs> you're right. I am afraid. I'm 50 something <clears throat> years old. I never seen. I feel like I'm dreaming. <laughs> More like a nightmare, I'd say. <sighs> yeah. I want to wake up and have a smoke already. Meet me back here when you finish looking around the hospital. Okay? Roger. Roger, Roger. Turns into a fucking droid. Dude, the facial animation of this game is so crazy. For a 20-year-old game. I can't get over, like, how this game looks. Music's back to being good, which is nice, compared to whatever the fuck was on that boss fight. This is PS2, yeah. Uh, I'm not sure if this came out on Xbox. Oh, all right. I saved so good, I broke my switcher. There we go. Ah, uh, here we are. All right, we're room. There it is. Toluca Lake. It's all coming back. Uh, oh, we can go to Pete's Bolorama. Pete's Bolorama. Let's go. Um, all right, we got to make our way all the way back to the hospital. Oh, actually, give me the katana. Time to check the other rooms and stuff. God damn it. Maybe they won't see me. Uh, oh, I guess we have to go to Pete's uh, Bolorama. I wonder if this is a situation where it's like worth it to explore the town a little bit. To find like hidden things, but I think we're pretty well stocked. <sighs> why couldn't uh, why couldn't Eddie shoot more dogs? Listen, fuck Eddie, fuck Eddie in that terrible boss fight. This is a nice change from the subway tunnels, true. Because we are, uh, we have a map and we're back in a familiar place. <gasps> Can we bowl? Bowling minigame? Oh, this is the club. This is the club. This is where you start as, uh... I forgot what her name is from 2. Oh, great, more jerky. I'm sure the jerky is so fucking good, and I'm just not even using it. Tourism pamphlet. I'd forgotten it, but it it's true. Silent Hill was originally a resort town. Welcome to Silent Hill! 
Silent Hill, a quiet little lakeside resort town. We're happy to have you take some time out of your busy schedule and enjoy a nice restful vacation here. Row after row of quaint old houses, a gorgeous mountain landscape, and a lake which shows different sides of its beauty with the passing of the day from sunrise to late afternoons to sunset. Silent Hill will move you and fill you with a feeling of deep peace. I hope your time here will be pleasant and your memories will last forever. Roger Widmark. Thanks, Roger. Mr. Rogers? No, no, no. Roger Klotz. That's his pen name. Yeah, dude. It's got bowling. Yeah, what else do you need, dude? Oh, fuck off. Does it have a combination Pizza Hut and Taco Bell? Oh, dude. The best stuff. The best shit. <clears throat> Man, I fucking hate that. Not a fan of that noise, but we're back to the hospital. There's nothing useful there. The map! The map! Yes! Found it fast this time? I think we found it pretty quickly in, in Silent Hill 2. It's Silent Hill 1 that I literally went through the whole hospital before finding it. Hey, you know what? On the second playthrough, though, I nailed it. Oh, the nurses are in this. Nice. Not nice with the fucking camera angle, dude. Oh, wait, hold on. Can I block? I can't block, right? So, like, is it... Oh. Oh, damn! Oh, I didn't block in time. Huh. It did look like they were doing the stanky leg. I gotta say, these nurses, not as sexy. Not as sexy as the other ones. They made the nurses less sexy, dude. Chat, why didn't you tell me this game was fucking woke? Woke trash. <laughs> Lay woke SJWs. Oh, how did she, how do you stab? Oh, she wasn't dead. Stop. Stop morbing. Looks like I'll be doing a lot of fighting in here. I wonder if the bulletproof vest might be a good move here since... Oh, can I examine this? <clears throat> to my dear daughter, I hope this will never come to any use. Maybe it's better if you never know. More than anything else, I fear the possibility of your going away far from me. But sometimes you have to tell the truth. That's why I'm writing this before I'm lost in death and oblivion. What happened back then, that has something to do with who you are. It all started 24 years ago. Coming back from vacation, my wife and I found a baby on the side of the highway. Since we were childless, childless, excuse me, we thanked God for letting us meet this child, this girl. We took her home. 
Three years later, my wife died. Another four years later. Uh, 17 years ago, I came to Sun Hill. I heard the girls please and took her with me, not knowing why she wanted us to go there. Uh, and it was there that the girl went away. Not that she actually went anywhere, nor did she die. Returned to her original self. That's what Dahlia Gillespie said. Or Gillespie said. Original self. <clears throat> That was a young woman burned by her mother as a sacrifice to God, Elisa, Elisa, Alessa, uh, Gillespie. Half her soul escaped in those flames and went on to live in a baby in that girl of mine, of ours. Seven years passed before that half a girl returned to Sun Hill and made Alessa whole again, newly strengthened. She vowed to kill God. God, a fetus nestled into this sacrificial girl's womb, you know, as, as, you, as you do, was summoned with the usual rites. Uh, this was Elisa's wish, no matter what the outcome, even if her own existence were at stake. Uh, but that wish was not granted. My interruption meant she prayed instead for the girl's return. I alone couldn't bring her back. Dahlia did it. I only helped at the birthing ceremony to bring God out of Elisa. The newly born God wailed once and was dead. All from that girl's and probably Elisa's conscience resistance. Uh, that's not the end. After God, after God had vanished in a glow of light... Uh, Lisa reappeared and gave me a baby. She looked a lot like that girl so long ago. Then Lisa was gone, uh, dead. There was nothing I could have done to help. I simply clutched the baby to my chest and ran off. The whole thing felt like a dream, but I had proof that it wasn't. The girl was nowhere to be found. And in my arms, the baby. The 17 years have passed. It feels like only yesterday. And again, it feels like a million years ago. I confess I had reservations at first about raising that baby. Could I love her? Her existence was thoroughly unexplainable. I thought she could be that young woman who snatched away my beloved daughter that led to sadness, anger, sadness, anger. There, there were times when I put my hands around her tiny little throat. You guys ever just choke a baby? Several times I even considered abandoning her. That's what a terrible person I am. But I decided to raise her after all. I just couldn't seem to let her go. When she, when you look at me, you laugh so. Even now, I can't forget about that girl, but I love you. I have no doubts about that. That's all I ask you to believe. To my precious daughter, Harry Mason. My name's not Harry Mason. So that's your recap of one, essentially. He forgot the part where she looked like a Chipotle burrito, but we'll let it slide. Oh, did I put the thing back on? Yes, I did. See ya. Okay, well, let's not go in there. There are a lot of things stuck to the wall. A cookie, a toothbrush, a spoon, a Christmas card, a clock. Whoever it was probably used glue, but why do this in the first place? Oh, there's a key. There's a key glued to the wall... It love. I'd love to take it with me, but it's stuck real tight. I can't even pull this off. Can I grab the beetle? Is it Ringo? All right, so we need to come back there at C4. Lick the wall clean. All right, I think we do have to go in that room with like the seven nurses. I wonder if I can just, like, cut that. Kind of like we broke that wall to get the silencer. Oh. Play with dolls like this when I was a child, too. really takes me back. <clears throat> the day has finally come. That's right. The day when you and I will meet. I was always thinking of you here in this gloomy cell. I never even knew your name or face until today. But now I know. I know you're the one I've been waiting for. And haven't you been waiting for me, too? That's why you came to rescue me. Oh, how I love you, Heather. That's me. I want to give you my prized doll I made to commemorate our meeting, the start of this everlasting love. I can already see your smiling face. Stanley Coleman. Hey, Stanley. Uh, fuck off. Oh, whoops. <clears throat> Dude, I have simps. This 
Is that everything in here? Oh, we have the E room. No, thank you. Oh, this elevator works. Interesting. <coughs> all right. So we still have that room on the first floor with all the nurses. Hopefully I can avoid it. Hopefully. leaving me clues. <clears throat> hey, Stanley. You may not yet have realized your own true feelings, but you sense them unconsciously. And so you're trying to get close to me. That's a virtue. The path to paradise. If the door's locked, open it. If the door's locked, open it. Use the password for the prison gates. Doctor, I've forgotten his name. Anyway, that quack has it posted. Uh, he should be here too. I mean, four numbers would have been good enough, but he kept on going. Isn't it a shame? I'm not there. Aren't you irritated? I long for you, but you're so cruel. Still, I want you, Heather. Good. And then the thing again. There's a typewritten memo posted here. What's this supposed to mean? The first is larger than the second. The second, twice the third. The thir Is this a puzzle? Oh, fucking it sure is. All right. We'll get to that in a second. I think there's another path over here. I am going to break out the notepad, without a doubt. Oh. Puzzle difficulty is just set to, set to normal, so I don't hate my life. Ooh, nail polish remover. That's probably for the glue. Oh, and I got something else. What the fuck was that? started with a P. Uh, oh, perfume. I just got found a penis in the locker. Oh, you know what? There was something in one of these lockers that stopped me in the hospital. There was like a coat or like a doctor's coat in one of the lockers I missed for like 20 minutes. That was great. Okay, so is the is the keypad is it just your normal keypad? Okay, one through nine. Okay. So one through nine keypad. And then let's, uh, oh boy, dude. Oh boy. Okay. Let's start working this together, chat. Okay. First is larger than second. Second, twice the third. Third, okay, fuck. Smaller than fourth. Fourth is half the fourth first okay okay for the number okay numbers don't repeat three are not in the top row two are not in the right row one of the numbers is the final key what well yeah Obvi obviously one of the numbers is okay I don't know what that means but Okay. Let's take a look. That's like saying road work ahead. I sure hope it does. Okay, let's see. So the first number is larger than the second. Three numbers are not in the... T okay, so... So the first is larger than the second, and the fourth is half of the first. Uh... Let's see here. Yeah, can we put it in emote only mode while I try and work this through? I have my notepad here. Uh, so, let's see. So, it has to be doubled. So, it's not two. Not four. Well, maybe four, actually. 
Well, the second has to be twice the third. But the third is smaller than the fourth. So if it's six, then the last number would be three. The second is twice the third, but it's smaller than the fourth. I don't think that's it. Well, hold on. How many are in the right row? Oh, two. Oh, well, two are in the right row. Hold on. Three are not in the top row. Oh, two and three are in the top row, so that's not it. So if it's not six, then it's maybe eight? Okay, so if it's eight, then the last number would be four. And then the second is twice the third, and the third is smaller. So if it's less than four, it's three. It can't be two because then the second number would be four, and that's not possible. And then the second is, so it would be six. Is it eight, six, three, four? Uh, three numbers are not in the top row. Okay, that's true. Only three is there. Uh, two numbers are in the right row. Three and six. Oh, maybe. Hold on. Is it eight, six, three, four? Let's go! We got it. Hell yeah. Nice. Alright, we're moving. We're moving and grooving. gun? What do you mean? What happened to the pipe? Alright, well, I'm glad I got the bulletproof vest on. Yeah, you can tell this is America. Yeah, I played Dredge on Xbox for Achievements. I perfected it somewhat recently. Yes, I also finished the new uh, Vampire Survivors DLC. That shit was rad. Yes. Should I write this down? I'm gonna write this down. So what is this, uh, it's not quite seven, so is it six, was that 58? Can you imagine, do you think there are people out there, like grown ass people who maybe don't know how to read an analog clock, it would be like, I don't know what time it is? I feel like that's a common thing. I assume they still teach that shit in school, but yeah, I remember learning about how to read an analog clock in like, like elementary school, but yeah, that's 658. I don't know if AM or PM matters, but a 24 hour clock military time. I mean, I've told the story a thousand times. The re only reason I know how to read a military clock or 24-hour clock is because when I got my first cell phone, I accidentally changed my time to that, and I didn't want to change it back. So I just learned how to read it. And now I always keep my phone in that. Like, my phone says 1834 right now. The attache case is locked. Oh, do we think this is just the time that we just wrote down? 0658? Oh. Oh, that was easy. Okay. An instant camera. 
cool. Yeah, back dude. to back puzzles. Silent Hill. How dare you? <clears throat> There's a TikTok of a kid showing times on a clock to his fellow classmates and no student knew how to read the analog clock. Wild. I mean, everything's like digital at this point, but still. Unlike a normal camera, you can see the developed photos right away. So I wonder what that's for. Nail polish remover. What was the other thing? Perfume? Interesting. Another fun room. See ya. I'm never going to be part of a creative clash. I don't get it I don't get the appeal is there literally nothing in here oh this health kit get out get out okay only got hit once not bad yeah no one wants to watch me fight I mean, I guess it's for... Oh, I was in here already. I guess it's for charity, so that's good. But I can't imagine, like, wanting to see someone with little to no boxing experience box for, like, a couple of rounds. I guess the appeal is a lot of people go to it, so, like, maybe it'd be cool to see friends, but, like, the event itself, I don't... Doesn't do anything for me. There's medical records here. Could this be for the dead guy? Background unknown. Name, age unknown. Not admitted. Patient found in poor mental state on hospital grounds and temporarily installed in room M4. Chief's discretion. Died late tonight from blood loss due to severe or severed cardioid artery. Was grasping his own kitchen knife. and Oh, he killed himself. Good. Possible suicide, but wound angle suspicious. Sent to second floor treatment room for further investigation. Have received no proof or corroboration of event from patient residing in the same room. Have not notified police. However, for future necessity, leave victim's bed in effects M4. Hand sticking out, something written on it. What? Man's corpse lay on the stretcher. The hand that is sticking out of the sheet has something written on it. Can I, like, am I supposed to, like, foot, take a picture? Can I not, like, oh, we have to be, like, right up against it. Fart. Oh, tart. Thought that was an F. My something. Tar key? What's he saying? Oh. The start time is my key. Oh. I. Was this for the briefcase? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. Thanks. Can I suck his toes? No, this game sucks. Uh, okay. I guess we'll head back downstairs. Try to get that thing off the wall. Pipe, and what's the other one? Oh my god, camera, please. Camera, holy shit. Alright, well, guess I'm just waiting. Doing the stanky leg for good. She's got a gun. Okay, never mind. Stop. All right, excuse me. Did I go this way? I did. Ooh, a raid from Tans Gaming. Yo, what's going on? Welcome on in. Ooh, another raid from Blag. Welcome on in. I'm playing Side Hill 3 for the first time. It's, uh, it's something. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you're having a good Sunday. Welcome on in. Welcome on in. You can take off father-only mode, uh, glasses. If you don't mind for the raid. Raids. You did? Okay, cool. Just making sure. Welcome, gamers. Welcome. What am I looking at here? I love, oh god, the subway part of this game. Jesus Christ. Awful. 
Oh, Dan was playing the new Sherlock Holmes game? Holy fuck. Was it good? Did he solve all of the mysteries? I should go save quickly. Yo, Tech, thanks for the 16. Yeah, is he, is he Sherlock now? to go to C4. Let's go. Oh, how's my health after? Oh, it's okay, I guess. Holy cheat. Hey, man, how's it going? I kind of want to check out the the other nurse room. To see, like, if there's anything in there. Oh, wait. Did I read this one? I don't think I did. This is the final one. The organization has me shut up in here. They mean to break my will to make me forget about all that. But I'll stay sane even if they throw me in here with lunatics. How about if I stick these to the wall? That would be worth it. You can peel it off, can't you? With that junk, those nasty wenches won't stop using. If a thing has no meaning, there's no reason for it to exist at all, just as you exist for me. But why haven't you taken my doll with you? Ah, my gift must have embarrassed you. How cute you are, Heather. Thanks, Stanley. So, uh... Nail polish remover, huh? There we go. The stairwell key. Anything else I need from here? Office wing stairs. Okay. B for bros. What's going on, man? Hope you're doing well. I think this is the party room. Nope. I think this is the party room. Okay. Well, that didn't work. There's literally nothing in here. Okay. Did a little loop-de-loop. -loop, didn't see anything. Okay. Do you have a gun? Nope. I gotta heal again. Um. Oh, do we think maybe by the elevator over there in the room I was, or the area I just was? Oh, it might be right above the day room as well. Shout to that heavy breathing. Alright, let's make our way back to the elevator. Love of Plague, see you later, man. Thanks for hanging out. go to the other elevator which is oh that e okay should you order pizza absolutely you should dude i think i'm having pizza for dinner i think i'm having baron a little red baron pizza for dinner that's pretty exciting we got taco bell let's go let's go dude No, Sabar God, I wish Sabaros was, uh, there's a Sabaros nearby just for the meme. Get myself a New York slice. Remember Karn Evil? I do. I remember playing in the arcade. Alright, that's a pipe. I can go the other way. How much is left on the Taco Bell card? Uh, I haven't used it in a while. I think still around $200. Keep hitting the wrong button. Oh, it's right here. 
There we go. Nice. Is Sabaro actually considered good? I mean, I think it's fine. I've said this before. I'm not really too much of a stickler for pizza. It's really hard to fuck up pizza. Uh, the worst pizza I've ever had... Oh, boy. Worst pizza I've ever had is uh, CeCe's Pizza. The one time I had it. Huh. Submachine gun bullets. It's kind of worthless without the fucking submachine gun. But yeah, like, Sabaros? I think Sabaros is fine. Alright, so this is open now, right? I've opened this door. Okay, good. That's open now. I've never had the Mexican pizza at Taco Bell. I usually get the same, like, one of four items at Taco Bell. I generally find something I like at a place and uh, just get that over and over again. I don't really experiment too much. Taco Bell, it's either uh, chicken quesadilla, crunch wrap supreme, and then uh, soft tacos or the, um, like the Doritos taco. Some combination of that. Ooh. Okay. Guess what? I'll check that. Oh, fucking Stanley. Oh, boy. Following freely your ebony hair like the night sky, scattering fragrance. My heart clamoring in my chest like a storm, you trifle with it. Your pristine glance like a feast when you smile. My thoughts disturbed my breath like opium. It drives me mad. Eric, a great poet who conveys my feelings so well. I shouldn't have let this place get to me. Should never have gone crazy, but it's superbly enjoyable to drown in my love for you. But... Why won't you accept proof of my love? Don't stand on ceremony. Now, after all, you and I exist as one. What I give to you is the same as what I give. Okay. Don't fucking like that. So where does this lead? All right. See ya. Now that I'm ready. So is this room, do you unlock just that? Just a troll room? Fucking okay, I guess. Guys, I got pranked. There's a memo on the wall. Punishment for brutality towards patient. 12 hours confinement in the special treatment room. Dismissal policy no longer in effect. Contact the chief if you have any questions. There's something handwritten on the top of the Tyrant sentence. The trick is not to leave any marks. Okay. And one other thing. This looks like it was written by a different person. The chief is a pervert. Uh, Christy would have been better off if she had been fired. What the fuck is going on in here, dude? Did I just kill Christy? Was she the perv? All right, we got the storeroom over here. We got a save there, okay. Some heals. Okay. Oh, my God. There's more writing. <clears throat> Heather, my most sacred lover, I'm always watching you. No matter where you are or what you may be doing, I have never lost sight of you. I know you feel intensely lonely, yet with a single key to this door, those feelings won't stand in the way any longer. We haven't been able to see each other for so long. Be patient. It's just a little longer. I'll be patient too, even though I long to hold you in these hands of mine. The key is behind the shelves in the underground garage. Why there? Ask the idiot doctor. Let me write that down. Uh, key behind shelves in underground garage. There's not a single person here who's right in the head, not just in this hospital. I mean, in all of Silent Hill, except me, Stanley Coleman. <laughs> okay. Stanley, I don't, I don't think that's right. I don't think you are right in the head. I bet you this dude pushed, pushed me into the subway. Yeah. He's actually driving the train. Whoops. Made a messy. 
don't know how to drink out of a can. Dude, he's built different. Uh, okay, let's go to the left over here. All right, nothing over here. Something makes me believe that Stanley's going to be like a boss or something. Or Stanley's whatever's left of him. Uh, shit, what would I say last time? Do you think it's the same code? What was it, eight? Oh, fuck. Hold on. Oh, wait. I might be able to undo. Uh, hold on. Where is it? 8634. There it is. Nope. That's not it. Hmm. Oh, what was the other thing? 0658 was the other one, right? Uh, oh, there's no zero. Okay. Hmm. I wonder what the code for that is. Uh, all right, let's keep looking. Oh, fucking Christ. Oh, no, I want to read the creepy thing. Hmm, excuse me. Just taking a look around. Yeah, thanks for the submachine gun bullets. I need the actual gun. What, am I going to throw the magazines at them? Oh, shit. There's a door there. Can you guys, like, reposition? Yep, that's broken. And I can't climb that. Uh. Oh, that was lucky. Okay. Oh, the book is gone. Interesting. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll go back down to the basement. Queen Silverfang, hello. How are you? How are you? Hope you're doing well. Hope I find that Uzi. Or as we called it earlier. Or someone called it earlier. The Uwuzi. Have plenty of ammo. Would love to actually find it. Um, same. You ever just lose the will to roll? Oh, is this where the key is? I can't squeeze into there. Huh. I got it, dude. The camera. What? Wait. What? Oh, is this the code he was talking about? For the door? That makes sense. Now, it makes sense. It makes sense now. That was uh, that was a joke, by the way. It's 3726. That's what Stanley was talking about. I just figured we had to move it, but... Uh, yeah, that's that's how you do it. You... I'm the smartest streamer in my office. Oh, the Ubu gun. There it is, chat. Silent Hill did kind of cuck my joke. I am a little upset about that. <laughs> uh, can I go in the pump room? Nope. Why would I be able to do that? Uh, what floor was that thing on? Was it the, th th the third floor we need to go to? Okay. I assume the elevator doesn't work. No. Why would it? 
The blood trail continues into the elevator. Part of me wants to peek in, but then it's a little creepy, too. Yeah, it is. With all the blood and bullets? Are you kidding me? You want to take a look in there? <clears throat> this is where Hunk's pals <laughs> killed Perkin. So let me heal. I'm playing a dangerous game here. Uh, we have 14 of these. I'll use those. Okay. Oops. There you go. How much ammo do we have for the Uzi? 96. Got a lot of, a lot of handgun ammo. Did I ever put the, I put the silencer on it, right? I think I did. Yeah, there you go. Oh, this is where, uh, oh my god, what was her name? Maria? Was? Tissue and an alarm clock, huh? The clock's broken, but otherwise no big deal. Teaching Despair, Hope House. Hope House, an orphanage on the outskirts of Silent Hill, but behind its false image is a place where children are kidnapped and brainwashed. Hope House is managed by the Silent Hill Smile Support Society. Alliteration. A charity organization sometimes called 4S. It's true that 4S is a well-respected charity that takes in poor children without homes and raises them with hope. But at its heart, it is a heathen organization that teaches its own warped dogma in lieu of good religious values. Miss, Mr. Smith, temp, who lives near Hope House, had this to say. Sometimes at night, I can hear their weird prayers and the sound of children crying. I went there to complain one time, but they ran me right out. Since then, it hasn't changed a bit. In fact, this reporter... Uh, was refused admission when he attempted to take photographs in the facility. What exactly do the folks at Hope House hope to hide? Or have to hide? Um, during my investigation, I was able to discover, however, a suspicious-looking round concrete tower which appears to be a part of their facilities. Fortunately, no one was willing to tell, tell us what the tower was used for, but it seems unlikely that it has anything to do with the business of raising orphans. It may, in fact, be a prison or a secret place of worship. Uh, the cult religion that operates Hope House is known by the locals simply as the Order. It is a religion that is deeply inter interwoven with Silent Hill's history, but its worshippers' fervent belief that they are among the elite chosen people. The elite chosen people has a dark and dangerous side. I intend to continue my investigation of Hope House and the cult behind it. I've always believed that telling the whole truth and showing the children the true path is our most important duty. Joseph Schreiber. Hope House. I feel like I've heard that name before. Fucking have you. I don't think I have. Maybe I have. I don't remember. God, this fucking game. Oh, well, the clock's broken. The doll's being ripped apart. Goodbye, Heather. I'm sorry I wasn't able to respond to your love. It's all over. Leonard despises me because I made fun of it, saying it would come to this. If it weren't for this meddling, I would have been able to meet you in just a little while. Then I could have taken you to my world, a world for us alone, more beautiful than this one. And I had been waiting <clears throat> waiting for this day, for today, the day I'd see you, the day you'd save me today. Heather, watch out for him. Leonard is no ordinary guy. Farewell. I loved you. Heather, my goddess. Heather, my lover. Heather, my... Okay. Kind of, kind of weird. Oh, shit. Is that jerky? Let's go. Uh 
Okay. Oh, she has a gun. Cool. So does uh, pistol, huh? Sounds pistol. Do you think they heard that? Fuck it, I have no idea. Moshi, mo moshi, moshi. Not quite. No, I'm not. Don't lie to me, Claudia. You're always trying to run from your responsibilities. Have you come to apologize? Or maybe you still don't realize how foolish you've been. The salvation of all mankind. Ah, what a ridiculous dream. Wait, just listen to me for a second. I've heard enough from you already. How did you turn out this way? Where did I go wrong? Listen to me already. I'm not Claudia. You're not Claudia. My name is Heather. Heather. Who are you? Leonard Wolf. Leonard? I'm sorry. I thought you were my daughter. Oh, Claudia's dad. Claudia is your daughter? Why did it take you 15 seconds to say that? You know her, do you? Are you one of her followers? No, never. Are you writing? Find her. I'm. I can feel the hatred. What? Behind your words, the anger. You plan to kill her, don't you? Yeah. my father she's a fool but she's still my daughter i was going to forgive her if she changed her ways but i see it's too late heather will you help me help you i'm locked up in here and i must stop claudia where are you now not sure myself, but the door is at the end of the hall on the second floor. I think I can be of help to you. I have a seal. Please. Like the animal? A seal? All right. Oh, he's, he's got the singer. I got it. Hear kiss from a rose in the background, just faintly. All right, well, we gotta go to the second floor. Excuse me, pardon me, pardon me, excuse me. Excuse me, ladies. Oh, there are more doors. Oh, I have to check even though I know they're gonna be locked. Yep. Come on, get up. It's fine, we got a bulletproof vest. I fucking knew it, why'd I go back? I'm stupid. Excuse me. Okay. Is it metal pipe, uh, metal pipe proof? I think it just restricts all damage or um, lowers all damage. Guessing he means like M6. Hmm. 
What's up, Patrick? Oh, good. We're in the other world hospital. Am I? I'm just going in a circle. This is where I came in from, right? Or did I get lucky? Uh, oh. I think I'm making progress. Really a phenomenal camera angle here. I assume it's a straight line. Oh, okay. Um. Oh, this is... This is awesome. This is so cool. This is great. This is where I came in from, I think. I, dude, what do we... I, was I here? I don't have a map. I live here now. This is the rest of the stream. Oh, actually, I don't know why I just thought about this. Let me just reload my gun. I don't have my crutch, which is the map. I actually... Still has an unusually high fever. Eyes don't open. Getting a pulse, but just barely breathing. Why? What is keeping is that this Lisa? alive? What the hell was I daydreaming? No, it was more like watching a video in a dark room, but that nurse, I know her. Lisa, who was so heavenly toward me in that hellish hospital room. She did get a little weird, though. Lisa, my wife. Good thing nothing bad ever happened to her. I don't know how the fuck I navigated that maze, but okay. Lisa did have the moment, though, at the end of Silent Hill 1 where she dragged that guy to hell. Which was kind of sick. I forgot the guy's name. The, the drug guy. Hey, man. How's it going? Just turning that valve? That's cool. Oh, man. Got impaled. That's rough. Um, I don't... Oh, the door's right there. I'm fucking blind. Is it working hard or hardly working? What the fuck is this? What the fucking graphics not load? At least my map works again. This is 144p world, yeah. That's a fun fucking noise. Oh, not these guys again. That's a wall. Awesome. Excuse me. Oh, it's the elevator. Doy. Uh, open this back up. We probably have more shit to look around in here. Hmm. Yeah, dude. Don't like this.
Oh, good. Great. Huh. Is that bad? I'm gonna try and leave. Oh, it's on me. It's on me! I'm morbid right now. Um. I have an idea. I'm going to break the glass. Yep. Genius play. Okay. The pedestrian bonk is always so funny. Oh, uh. Can I leave now? Okay. Um. Cool. That was spooky. Get off my leg, chode. I don't know, Heather. Just turn around. Thank you. It's a door. Just got spooked by a door. Okay, I'm here now. I'm gonna grab this ammo. Please don't scare me. Cool, thanks. I guess I have to leave him hanging, unfortunately. That mirror room was scary as fuck. It was creepy. Um, I think I did everything I needed to do in here. Yeah, I think we need to go back to the elevator. Bad luck, bad luck. You guys are just making a fucking perfect wall. Oh my god. I love video games. They are my passion. Thank you. Someone say, did someone say wall? Yeah, I think we have to go to the elevator. Earlier in the game, if you inspect one of the bathroom mirrors, Heather mentioned she doesn't like him. Oh. Uh, second floor? Sure. I feel like this game has a lot of have a, has a lot of callbacks and shit. Okay. Shout out to that person raging in chat telling me to shoot the enemy. I could, but then I would still get hit because there's three of them. At least they won't hear it. It's a weird spot for that.
not rotary, not interested. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear. <laughs> I forgot your name. Who are you? Oh, okay, thanks. Happy birthday, dear. Who are you? Oh, classic, Happy dude. Birthday. Got a comedian on the other phone, on the other line. Happy 31st birthday. Is this Leonard? That's the murderer's name, not my name. I'm not your beloved Stanley. No, oh, he's not my beloved Stanley. It's it's fine. He's underground now. His new name is Number 7. <laughs> But don't worry about that now. It's time to celebrate your birthday. You've got me mistaken for someone else. Today's not my... I'm not mistaken. Today is your 24th birthday. And I have a present for you. Which do you prefer? To give pain or to receive it? You can have the one you hate the most. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Thanks, man. You're wrong. It's not my birthday. Really, that's all you got out of that? The birthday thing? Not the choose your pain or there's a guy in the basement named number seven? One of the kids next door, I think. All right. Well, there will be pain. Um, the woman's locker room. Hell yeah. A plastic bag. Oh, and a health drink. I'm gonna go. See ya. Oh, there's no door over here, huh? Well, that's upsetting. I what the plastic bag is for. Let's see. Yeah, I think we did everything over there. Totally ordinary, transparent plastic bag. This is from a trash can in the locker room. Oh, we got to combine it with the uh, perfume. Wait, I can equip the perfume? What? Okay. Interesting. To smell good? Uh, yeah, I guess so. All right. Right off spawn, huh? Oh, wait. I want to go down to the first floor is what I wanted. Whoops. My bad. Excuse me, fellas. Did I just pass it? Sure did. Fuckers are just everywhere, huh? Alright, how many... 
how much of this floor is going to be open? All right, good start. Oh, it's the nurses. All right, this room is just locked in. Oh, Halloween Queen, I love you too. Thanks, man. Oh, is it? Oh, great. My boy Stanley? Oh, that. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh God. The world is teeming with unnecessary people. In God's, it's God's decision that I fight as a knight of honor. As a protector of the seal, I sacrifice myself to the blood of criminals. Who wrote this? Some twisted individual, eh? I see this and I want to ask him. So you think you're one of the necessary ones, but it seems like I've heard this protector of the seal business somewhere before. It's kind of weird. <laughs> I wrote it. Oh, shit. Heather <laughs> sounds cringe. Can I leave? No, I didn't think so. Oh, this is a nothing room, it looks like. Heather, are you looking at something? No, okay, just a door. Oh, oh, this is literally a nothing room. Cool. Thanks. Uh-oh. Yep. Don't worry, guys. She doesn't hear me. I'm going to take the suppressor off. Because I don't think it's really doing anything. She do be moaning, though. Stop. Stop it. Shut up. Alright. Anyway. All this for a fucking dead end. I love it. Never mind. There's a door here. Oh, safe spot. Awesome. Uh. Oh, butt plug. It really looks like I can grab something over here, but... Dr. Midkiff. Oh, that's my favorite streamer. Please use extra caution with the patient in room 312. I'm about to bust. Um, let's see. Room 312. He should still have his religious freedom here in the hospital, but he shouldn't push his faith on others. I'm a victim, too. Rumor has it he got here by stabbing someone over a religious dispute. Please be careful. R. Crosby. P.S. It looks like the rumor... It looks like the rumor is true according to the head nurse. I do think he is a good person. Otherwise, though, he's easy to deal with. Sure. I'm just here to save. Also, thank you for that store order, whoever that was. And pop. All right. Uh, I guess we just keep going down. What's up, Lopes? Who's alive? Why does it sound so fucking moist? Oh, I gotta check over here. I didn't go over here yet. Oh, it's another nurse. You have a gun? Yep. Okay. Don't do it. I really just don't want to deal with you. Thanks. Everything's locked. Oh, that one's... Uh, nope, don't. Dodged it. I'm like, Neo, bitch! Wrong door. Um. Alright, let's go to B3. Let's go to B3 and work our way up from the basements. 
She tried to pistol whip? Yeah, she does. She tries to melee you if you're close. How's the game going? Game's going all right. What the? F what was this? A fucking saw trap? What is this? Uh. Uh, but the game's going okay. Six, eight, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, are you supposed to put these in, like, that order? And that's, like, their position? So... Sit six. Oh, let me just write these down. Uh, seven's in the back. So it's seven, and then eight, and then I think nine is... Or, yeah, nine is right here, right? Nine is right here. And then in the top was... Uh, six. Okay. So I think I understand. Yeah. So then we match it to the Roman numerals here. Okay. Yeah. So then it would be six, nine, seven, eight, I think. Let's see. Six, nine, seven, whoops, okay, seven, let's go, chat the sex number, dude, the sex number, speaking of the sex number, my wife, hi, you look cute in that shirt, it's almost like an Ono Michio shirt, you getting ready to go soon, okay, okay, Love you. Have Love fun you. at dinner. I miss you already. I miss you too. I'll be gaming. I have to come home. Okay. You're the best husband ever. I love you so much. Before you go, can you bring me uh, something to drink with flavor, preferably? Like, sure. Like a, like a little juice? Yeah. Well, because I'm a little juicy boy. Yeah. So what did that get me? Uh, a cremated key. Okay, that seems important. <clears throat> nice. That puzzle's kind of cool. Not too bad. I found this in some sort of crematorium underground. It's burned black, but still usable. Hmm. All right. Was it number seven, Stanley? Uh, number seven was uh, whoever the fuck that thing was about. I think it was Stanley. Okay. Oh, perfect. We can only go to B3. Uh, hold on. I don't have a map of this. Okay, well, we'll go back to the first floor and kind of reassess what we're doing here. Left for Donut. Thank you for the 34 months. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Uh, where the fuck are we going with this key? You guys like heavy breathing. I have no, no idea where we could use this key. Hmm. Let me actually go back up to the second floor. That's my asthma, sorry. Halo, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, my wife. I love you too. Have a fun at dinner. Mm. 
I got juice, let's go. Okay. So, uh, there's an enemy right there. Why the noises when it's paused? Because that's just Silent Hill 3, baby. Oh, fuck me. Heather, he's right in front of you. Oh my god, combat in Silent Hill is so bad. Oh, back to the reload. I shot the guy behind him? Holy shit, dude. Oh my god. This is why I don't shoot them. What's the point? What's the fucking point? I just got hit twice, three times maybe, and I didn't kill a single one. It like auto-aims, like it locks on, but since they were on top of each other, I guess I got the guy behind. Second to fucking breathe. Shooting is useless. Yeah, can I turn the gun on myself in game? How does health work in this game? If you look at the uh, your status in the top left hand corner. It goes from, like, blue to yellow to, uh, like, red. That's how you know you're dying. I'm going to the day room. Leave me alone. Okay. Clone Trooper, thank you for the five gifted subs. All right, let's take a second to, to breathe here. Okay, Christ Almighty. Christ Almighty. Okay. So, the only room we haven't been to that I noticed was <clears throat> Examination Room 4. So, that's what I'm heading toward right there. Um, there's also the save right there as well, so. Oh, right. It's this the fucking 144P room. All right, cool. This is a door that opens. Nice. That is just a bucket of what I assume is blood. Oh, hey, man. Oh, is this what I need the... Is this what I need the the bag for? Yep. Got a... Got a bag of blood. <laughs> okay. Great. Now what? Oh, the save is like right here. Chat, thank God we got that. I feel like we're making progress, though. <clears throat> Am I going to drink that bag of blood? Maybe. Does it bring me back up to max health? Because it might. Hmm. Oh, the day room has the, the opening. There it is. I think we have to go all the way down to the first floor of the day room. Fighter of the night room. Champion of the... Son. That wasn't blood, that was spaghetti sauce? I don't know, man. I don't think that guy was Italian. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. I don't know why that scared me. Are you 
applying Italian's bleed tomato sauce. Yeah, absolutely. One time I was hanging out with Chilled, he cut his arm on something and fucking Prego came out, like from a can. It was wild. <laughs> he let loose his ragu. True. Did I say can? I guess bottle would have been more applicable. Anyway. Hey, nice gun. Fuck you, idiot. Okay, we're in here now. Is that seven bullets? Yeah, it might just be better to hit him with a goddamn katana. Whoops. Are you still alive? I just wanna... Thank you, she was still alive. Oh, this is the other side of- okay. We're on the other side of this. Oh, great. Does that say happy birthday? Oh, what a fucking- I just got in the room! She have a gun? No, she has a pipe, okay. Yep. I swear to God, this room with three enemies and it's gonna have nothing. I can already tell. This is a colossal waste of time. Oh, I got a block. Good. Oh, first aid. All right, well. And some health. I retract my statement. There's something on the ground. Is this a birthday card? Happy 38th birthday. 14 plus 7 plus 17 is 38? Yeah, I'm going to write this down. But yes, that is that is simple math. Something's Someone's morbid in the other room. Examination room, broken lock. I can't even tell which one is a door. That guy's gonna hit me. Yep, yep, yep. There's like 47 enemies in here. Okay, that bitch has a gun. Oh, base, thank God. There's a stretcher here. Not just like your usual stretcher, this is more like an altar. And is that blood I smell? Oh, do they want the bag of blood? Title is Lost Memories. One characteristic mentioned only in rare documents and dying. Uh, and dying out in the modern age is that of the ritual sacrifice. Offering prayers, pierce a man's chest with a copper stake, uh, drench the altar in the blood. Which, okay, yep, yep. Cool, I got it. I forgot to do the Typhlosion raid. Oh, I forgot too. I did mine earlier today. But I think it comes back in like two weeks. Uh, if you have a uh, Annihilate build, you should be fine. Enjoying Silent Hill 3? Uh, I just think it's okay so far. I think it's easily my least favorite of the three I've played. Same with my HDMI switcher, apparently. Cool, thanks. No, no plans on playing the HD collection. I bought it on Xbox. It was on sale for like $5. But I doubt I'll ever play it, to be honest with you. The HD collection is like comically bad. I got it because it's like the only way I can get Xbox achievements in Silent Hill 2 or 3. And 2 is good. I'd play 2 again, but I'm not sure if I would want to play this again, honestly. Which sucks. I like Heather as a character a lot. Yeah, dude. 
I definitely want to check out the uh, Silent Hill 2 remake as well. But maybe I like Silent Hill 2 and I would play it again because we played the Enhanced Edition. Oh, this is a boss fight. I don't know what the fuck's coming up, but this is a boss fight. Stanley, you down here? Stanley, my lover? Heather? Yeah? Leonard. Yeah, dude. Where are you? Oh, I guess it's Leonard, right? Now I can finally... Stanley was dead in the other room. Yeah, man, whatever. Go ahead and do whatever you want. What do you mean by that? I mean that I don't think the way you guys do. I don't want any part of that kind of paradise. You're an unbeliever. You deceived me. I didn't deceive you. We were both just wrong about each other. I thought you were a normal person. You tried to trick me so you can run off with my seal, eh? My Heretic, seal! You plan to destroy God! I told you I wasn't trying to trick anyone. What is this seal thing anyway? Don't play innocent. You can't fool me anymore. The seal is mine! I was appointed by God to be its guardian! Oh. Ew. Is that you? Death. Looks like a fucking uh one of those things from Last of Us. Is every person here a mental case? <laughs> yeah, kind of. Oh god, I have my fucking katana out. This is kind of spooky, the way he just lurks in the water. Is this the fight? Uh. Uh. Oh, he has a wake up. Okay. Yeah, how is he swimming in this water? It's like a foot deep. Yeah, I definitely think uh, we were talking about this before when the cutscene started. I think Heather's my favorite protagonist. Harry's just like a normal guy, you know? He wants to save his daughter, and that's cool, but he's just like a, a dude. James is a fucking scumbag. Fuck James. He sucks. And then uh, Heather's just like a 17-year-old girl that's like, yeah, I don't care about any of this. <laughs> she just seems so uninterested. Harry does have the dumpy, true. I like Heather. That's why I, I hate, it's a shame that. You know, she's in Sun Hole 3, and so far it's my least favorite. I just, like, don't like the areas so far. I do like that some areas are reused. Like, running through Sun Hill has been fun. The hospital has been pretty cool for the most part, but the mall was kind of whatever. The subway was a f f fuck. 
was a war crime. And I feel like half of the map is just locked. Also, I mean, this isn't exclusive to this game, but obviously the combat is just awful. But I really like the music in this game, too. And I mean, for a PS2 game that's 20 years old, this game looks great. It really is just like the gameplay is the gameplay is still Silent Hill and some of the stage design is just like awful. And, like, the boss fights so far have kind of been, like, whatever. We fought a giant dick with foreskin earlier. Uh, the second boss is kind of involved. This is just not nothing. This is, like... Like, what? He swam around. Better than Eddie. True. Better than Eddie. Fucking Christ. Anyway, we beat him. Fuck you, Leonard. I'm also not 100% sure what the, we're doing in this story. I'm trying to listen, but I'm still not 100% sure what's going on. Is that an actual danger there? Uh, when he... He can, like, swing at you sometimes, but... I... <laughs> not really. I think we're just trying to kill Claudia. Yeah. He's not here anymore. I guess I should head back to the motel now. We want to kill Claudia because she killed her dad. Hope Douglas is okay. Also, there's Douglas and Ark Thompson's in this game. Huh? Uh, that's the seal we got. What's this? The Illuminati. They see all. Oh, it's a talisman. Never mind. Someone get Jackie Chan. Uh, for the person in chat that asked, I'm still going to play uh, Silent Hill 4 at some point. There'll probably be a bigger gap between this and Silent Hill 4. I've been playing a lot of uh, survival horror lately with the Resident Evil randomizers and then RE4, obviously, and now this. I'll take a little bit of a break. I feel like at the very least, I should at least finish the numbered games. <clears throat> And then after that, we'll see about the uh, we'll see about the non-numbered games. Like I said, I did play uh, Homecoming years ago for achievements, but uh, the only thing I remember is your soldier and the OP Why gun in that. Did you send her to my father? And the OP gun in that game is like a alien pistol or some shit. But he. Oh, but surely it's a good thing. Uh, it means he was one of God's beloved. No. Those who mock God. Will never receive salvation. You'll go to hell, Vincent. You'll not never Vincent. feel the joy of God's everlasting paradise. And you think God is going to save you? Ha! Huh. What do you huh. know anyway? I know about the pleasure. Okay. Dude, my switcher is having a conniption. Join a cutscene? Hey! Oh, what the fuck? It's just like super dead? What do you... I'm watching a cutscene! Did it actually finally die? I save stated so I could reload it, but hold on. What the fuck? Yo, it died! Hey! Hey! Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Hold on one second. No, my shitty HDMI. Okay, hold on, hold on. I think you might be coming back. Hold on.
It's not connecting to my PC anymore. Oh, no. Oh, fuck. Huh. Well. This might be an issue. Hold on, chat. All right, it reads my Xbox. Maybe it is the fucking HDMI cable for my PC. Oh, okay. No, we're back. We're back. Hold on. Oops, that's the wrong screen. All right, hold on one second. Do I have audio? Well, let's see. First things first. Let me reload the uh, save state. I think I, I think I got the save state. Hold on. Yes. But now I have no audio. Okay. Just read this for now, and then I'll deal with the audio. <laughs> I guess I should... guess I should look into a new HMI switcher that works, huh? Do the voices... Uh, I don't even know what they sound like. They just seem like almost like RE voices. Okay, a little scuffed, a little scuffed. Anyway, these two are having a conversation about something. You know, uh, God, some cult shit. They know each other. I guess they have different opinions or something. I don't know. You guys, did you guys get all that? Blind people in shambles right now. All right, hold on one second, gamers. YouTube, I'll be right back. I got to get this all fixed. YouTube, I think we're back. Hold on. Can I re can I reload the save state? Yeah. Th there we go. Hated you, father. All right, we're good. We're did back. You? I saw the way he hit you. Kicked you, made you cry. A little ten minute technical difficulty. We're good though. The memory of his cruelty is forever burned into my mind. Yes, yes, and that's why we need God. That's why, Chad. What you call faith is nothing more than a child. Crying out for love. That's why you're all alone. You don't understand. None of you do. And... Hey, we're back. Okay. And my controls are still good. All right. Okay. Jesus. So I think we need to go back to probably Jack's Inn. Jack's Inn. More like Jack's Off. I guess that'd be Jack Out. That'd be Jack. Fuck. Ruined the joke. HD splitter for an SD game. I mean, you know, it's, it's my PlayStation 2 plugged into my... Uh, a PC. Don't worry about it. <clears throat> oh, I should take off the vest now. Since we have some wiggle room. Oh my god, it's so much faster. You know what? It's behind me. I don't care. If I don't look, it's not there.
Can we give the HMI switcher a Viking funeral? Nope, it's still working. Just needed to unplug it and reset my computer. Chad, I'm telling you, I don't know what it is. I've bought, I've bought, I've bought like four other HDMI switchers with the same exact setup and it just doesn't work. It like doesn't read some of the inputs. It's, uh, it's wild. I wish I knew what it was or like how to fix it, but I have no clue. This is not where I need to go. Maybe I should power cycle it more. I can't re I can't even tell you the last time I unplugged that thing. Oh, that also had the problem with switcher. Seems like a gamble to find out which one actually works. Yep. I still use this shitty one because it works. Where's Douglas? He went out. But... He left a message for you. Was there someone else here just now? No, no, just me. Don't you want to know what the message is? Sure, man. Yeah, what did he say? The church is on Tableton. the other side of the lake. Lake of the 56. Church? I wonder what he meant by that. You don't understand? That's where Claudia is. Across the lake. On the north side. If you're going, you better go through the amusement park. Ooh. It's probably the only way in now. Are you going to see Robbie again? Go northwest on Nathan Avenue. It's a bit far. But closer than heaven. Is that it for the message? Uh-huh. Thanks. Douglas really said that? What's wrong? You don't trust me? No. Not at all. Okay. Northwest on Nathan, he says, huh? No, oh, we got a long ass fucking walk ahead of us. What brand is the HMI switcher? I have no idea. It's one of those uh, super sketchy brandless ones you can get on Amazon. Also, I think the actual like brand name is under it, but I can't lift it up. Right, we just stay, stay on this road. Can't wait to get all get on all the uh, all the amusement park rides. Dude, same. I feel like I'm getting kind of close, close, close-ish. Jesus Christ, can't talk to the end of the game. So maybe we just try to power through. I mean, Tina's at dinner, so I assume the dogs are taken care of. It might uh might be a late one, but I'll knock this out on one stream. With all this, uh, all this conversing between Claudia and what's his face? Okay. About two hours left. Yeah, I was about to say, it feels like we're getting, someone said like 75%, and that sounds about right. Yeah, dude. Hey, back to the start of the game. Timing on that was really good. <laughs> Heather, no! Oh, hell. Back here, baby! Alright, as always, chat, our first objective is find the fucking map. If there's a place you want to go, hey, yeah, we started here.
Heather is so dumb with this shit. She really is. Heather's great in this. It's a popcorn wagon. Nothing very interesting about it. Okay, but popcorn, though? The snack of champions? I can't get around Robbie, can I? Um, we go this way, right? Yeah, that's where we went last time. Uh, that's all blocked off. I think it's the same thing. Okay. What's up, Vagabond? You went to the Ren Fair? Dude, nice. Hope you had a good time. That's a dead end. Excuse me. Saw this shit still closed except that one store that was like over here or some shit. Those enemies, the fleshlight enemies we just walked past are my favorite enemies because they're big, they're slow, and they're easy to get around. Is this all still locked again? Okay, so this is all the same. where our nightmare was. Okay. I guess I go back to the... Uh, <laughs> the roller coaster? Hopefully I don't get run over. Uh. Hopefully I don't get run over this time. Oh, how convenient. It all fell over for a save. Oh, and a key. Roller coaster key. Okay. Oh, fucking Heather, the. Yeah, game. Draco, thank you for the 26. Thank you, base save states, for kind of saving our spot in that cutscene. I think we, we, we missed, like, three seconds of it, but we got the gist of that cutscene. All right. Yep. Oh, wait. It's this. Yep, this way. Go to the poster. Yep. Uh huh. Don't even look at me, you son of a bitch. Please let me through. Just let me through. Somebody's up here. The fuck is this? Health drink, health drink. This must be some gadget to control the roller coaster. I don't know how to make it work though. There's a power switch on the left hand side. Alright. The roller coaster is off. How do I get on the tr oh, right here? Another thing that's annoying about this game is just some of the sound design. It just goes on and on, and it is grating. Especially when you, like, pull up the map or pause the game, and you still hear it. It's like, have mercy. Oops. Oh, my God. Not again. Don't get hit by another train. Yeah, the same train from earlier is about to hit me. Ah! It's the guy from the subway. He flipped the switch. I hired you to find the girl. 
And do you perform serviceably? Oh, this is uh, Douglas. No. You lied to me about Heather, lady. I don't like being used. Lie? What lie? That Heather was kidnapped. But it's true. She was originally one of us. That man, Harry Mason, stole her away and kept her hidden from us. Yeah, but she says she was happy. She was brainwashed by him. Deceived, because her true self had not yet awoken. She carries God within her. Don't we all? But when Alessa, mother Alessa, God, there you go. truly awakens... Yeah? What's going to happen? She will usher in the eternal paradise. <laughs> what kind of place is that? A place with no pain, no hunger, no sickness, no old age. There will be no greed or war, and all will live by God's grace alone. Sounds good. No this, no that, no nothing. VR chat? Yeah, she's making VR chat. <laughs> Sounds pretty boring. I pity you. You still don't understand. You're going to kill me? Is it really so easy for you? Done it before. Oh shit. Then I truly do pity you. Put it sideways, Douglas. Yeah, Douglas, I'll do more damage if the gun is sideways. Area of the amusement park. Ticket booth. Once again, we're looking for a map. I assume it's on that first area since we played it already. Uh, chilled. Thank you for the 52 months. Chilled Kachow. Like walk across this thing or no? No, okay. Okay, you can't go inside there. Anything besides the safe point? Uh, nope. Okay. Sir Jex, thank you for the 15. Haunted Mansion. Dude, hope already Ed, uh, Eddie Murphy's in here. He was in Haunted Mansion, right? Eddie Murphy. Ready. Help. Help. Do you hear those voices? A family of four was sliced into bloody pieces. In oh, this Jesus. Oh, the cries of the children. The murderer was caught. Do you know why he said he killed his family? Let's hear it. I felt I had to. Ah. Uh. Anyway, I'm lying. 
Oh, you got me. It's all just a joke. Oh, you prankster. I wanted to scare you, that's all. The truth is, only one person died. By suicide. That was a neat effect. Seems kind of dark for an amusement park, though. Jesus. Oh, Jesus! Fucking! Woo! There's a body there, guys. Hey. That's Danny. Hey, Danny. A quiet young man. How's it going? Quite friendly, as you can see. Yeah, he looks great. I was so concerned on the dude in the chair. Town is New Orleans, but he came here after first losing his way. Yeah, I sh just shit my oh. pants. Can you let me through? Maybe you might know. Where is the path to heaven? Jeez, it's real. This is a real dead body hanging there. I don't think this they meant for this to be part of their attractions. Who would have done this? Oh, like so me. please watch your step. Sometimes the floor suddenly gives way. And I'm so sorry. Oh. This place is just falling apart. The mechanism is broken, you see. It wasn't supposed to stop there, I assure you. There's the exit. I hope you enjoyed your tour. Please come back anytime. <laughs> Woo to the gift shop, yeah. Uh, that was supposed to be the exit, but it seems that no one wants you to leave. Everyone really What the fuck is that? They want you to yeah, stay with yeah. you. I'm playing, pl fucking playing PT. I have to agree with them. Don't be afraid. Dying is much This section's actually kind of cool. I do wish the camera was in front of me, though. So I could see where the fuck I'm running? Any more low humming? Thanks. Oh, what's up, flashlight? How's it going? Hey, no map yet, by the way. That was the HMI switcher coming for me? Oh, fuck. We're just taking a guess. We're just flying. Oh, fuck me. I appreciate every enemy in the game being here, but like, it's a flyer for a musical. I thought this was the map. It's about Dawn the Duck, one of the park's mascots. Oh, shout out to Dawn. That's, is that a red shoe? That's absolutely bait. I probably need it, but... Alright, well, let's go grab it. Is this a chain? Okay. <clears throat> Good. Glad I got that. Um... Wait, really? Oh, I guess. All right. I 
guess we'll head back this way. Rocket swing, huh? What's over here first? It's closed. Oh, it could it be rusted? Maybe. There's gotta be a way. Oh! I got it. Oh, I need health. Real bad. I used the chain! The half is fine. Better do something with the other half, though. We gotta attach it to, like, uh, this shit. And then we, like, turn it on and it'll open the door? Unless I gotta, like, do this first. At least I think that's what we need to do. What's the point of turning it on? Huh. Well, let me see if there's anything over here. I mean, I <clears throat> I think that's what we're supposed to do. Oh, would that work? Wait, is that what it said? Wouldn't that work? The column here, wouldn't that work? Yeah. So, do I just grab this again? Or something? Attach this. I think that's what it wants me to do, but. Oh, I just have it in my inventory still. Okay. There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. I thought it wasn't in my inventory anymore because it was on the floor. Alright, now we turn this on. There we go. Nice. You missed six hours of the stream? Yeah, I've been playing through this. We're going to finish it up today. I think I'm getting near the end. Watch, I'm wrong. There's still like 12 hours left. Douglas. Hi, Douglas. You're late. Are you hurt? Can't move my right leg. It's broken. Good thing you got your Call left an one. What? I don't think we'll come. Don't worry. Whoa, hey! Getting yourself hurt like that? Relax! Sorry. Why did you have to do that for me? What'll I do if you die? What'll we do if this god thing gets born? <laughs> Come on. How powerful could a god from a dump like this be? I'm sure it'll be no big deal. Yeah, but anyway, something's gonna happen. Uh, who knows? Maybe we'd all be better off if it did. But if this is our God of Mercy axe, I don't want to see any more of him. That's a pretty good reason to risk my life, don't you think? Plus, I'm just an old fool. Yo, right? preach. Same. You think you're Superman or something? You know, I always Am I watching the explain video afterwards? Oh, f from that so, creator? Yeah. Glass has already sent me the link. You don't have to feel responsible. I know it's not your fault. You, you remind What's going on, Mo? How are you? You said... Nobody was going to cry for you. You had three people message you? Yeah, well, because he, like, he like uh, made them private or something, but they're still in the playlist, someone was saying. But why? Maybe because it's 
pop was a penniless good for nothing. Who knows? Anyway, now I guess I'll never find out. <sighs> Sorry. I shouldn't have said you reminded me of a guy like you. <laughs> well. Rip. <clears throat> You love the Mario Kart 8 videos on YouTube? Hell yeah. There's another one going up on Tuesday. Listen. I'm doing good, man. Thank you for asking. You stay here and I'll be back when it's over. Yeah, no one could be happy in these games. Okay, of course, it's Silent Hill. Hey, no problem. Besides, my dad's not around anymore. So only I can do this. Man, it was cool when Harry Mason was in the game for a second. Hey, whoa, hey, 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 hey. Bro, Chicho. What are you doing? Maybe killing you here is the only way to end this nightmare. Yeah, you might be right. I'm about to bust. Hank, not now. Hank, hold it. Hold it in. How the fuck did she know? Oh, hey, Robbie. You all right? What is it? I just came by to make sure you were still alive. Sorry. I'd come with you if I wasn't hurt. Yeah. Well, I guess that's the problem with older guys, huh? <laughs> More than you'll ever know. I'll handle things. You just rest. Yeah, I got it, Chief. Just came to blind you with my flashlight. <laughs> just right in front of his fucking face. Anything else over here or just, uh... Oh, there is more. Okay. That's where I came from, I think. Or maybe that's where I came from. The doors look the same. Okay, no, this is a different area. What does this say? The fortune house. Nice. Tell me my fortune. Oh, what is this? Claudia Wolf. Uh, searching for th then infant. Uh, Elisa Gillespie kidnapped by the man named Harry Mason. No word from police. Kidnap location unknown. Old Silent Hill newspaper article. Uh, Elisa Gillespie, seven, dead in fire. Links to current case to be investigated. Priority low. Using alias Heather. Neighbors do not know real name. What is she hiding? Huh. A doll head. Great. Okay. <laughs> so head. Bump, bump, bump. Is this? Is that Snow White? It's a Snow White doll. It's a Cinderella doll. Are these the? Uh oh. Do you? Hold on. Do you get this? 
And then you get this. Did did that? Am I good? Hey, Mister, you want to wrestle? Oh, it shows you. Yeah, she's holding a right, right, right. Are these photos of the doll? Cinderella on the left, Snow on the right, but something's wrong. Uh, did I not give him the right thing? Yeah, dude. Well, Steve-O says I did. Is that not right? Uh, am, am, am I good to just, to leave? Oh. I'm going to assume I did that right, but... I don't know if something was supposed to happen. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I can't pick him up again, so I guess I did something right. But I don't know what was supposed to happen, if anything. Uh. We're just moving and grooving. I'm just, I'm just running. I'm running in a direction that I hope is correct. This way. You think the cart kills me if I do it wrong? Uh, I kind of wish I did it wrong just for the... <laughs> getting hit by a train again, or a train-like thing. Oh, is that a body? Uh. Oh, are we gonna fight Sybil again? Uh, I don't have... I don't have the lean. What is this? There's a memo pinned to the horse side with a huge nail. When 13 turns count four, you will die from their curse. If you wish to escape, there is but one way out. To kill before you are killed, you will be saved by the twelfth death. What the fuck does that mean? What does that mean? The horse is alive. Well, alive may not be the word for it. It's no ordinary carousel horse. I made of water plastic. I don't know, but it's all kind of strange. The horse is the only one not moving. Is it because it was stabbed in the head? Am I really supposed to kill these horses? Uh, hey. Oh! Uh. It's time for the blade. I'm sorry, I think? Oh, he's dead. It's dead. Okay. Uh. Shusha! I I feel wrong doing this. Hopefully, this is actually for progress, or I'm just killing horses for no reason. Is that all in this inner circle? Okay. Oh wait, are these? Am I too far away? Yeah. That's overhead. Oh, that is faster. Optimizing my horse killing. Hobby, thank you. Yeah, no one tell Maddie or Mika. Yeah, why do I have to kill all of these? I feel like this is excessive. 
surely like, yeah, like I could have killed maybe like three and that would have been fine. I would have got my point across. Is that all of them? Uh, did, did, did I do it? Was there a point for me to do that? Did we win? What do you have? A knife. Oh, you're me from the mirror thing. Oh, yikes. Oh, is this supposed to be like a Lisa, maybe? I'm gonna make a quick uh, save state there. If I die, I don't know if I wanna go through the whole like killing the horses again, because that shit took a while. Um, I'm just gonna use a pistol, I guess, because I got a shit ton of ammo. I don't know. Like, how much ammo do I have here? I also have jerky. I can use jerky. I have 119 bullets if you count what's in my magazine. How did I lose her? What? She's right behind me. She's behind me now, right? Maybe. Uh, hello? Oh, found her. Oh, interesting. Uh... The fuck is this fight? Okay, does it have to be, uh... Maybe it has to be a melee weapon? Try this. Elisa, come here. Alessa, where the fuck your name is? What, what are we doing? Oh, camera. I. Am I. Oh, there we go. Oh, I think I have to block. I have to block. This is definitely a fight, huh? How am I in health? Oh, I'm okay on health. Something. Is she morbing? What's happening? Uh, okay. Oh, she has a gun now. Uh. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Why? Why do they not know how to make fun fights? Oh, did she get too close? Oh, 
Am I just like trying to get behind her, I guess? This is the right way to do this fight, but I'm. I. Did I win again? I. Oh, she's back to having a pipe. Or a melee weapon, I guess. Please let this end. This is so bad. This is, like, terrible. Am I winning? I think so? I'm actually blocking now properly. Okay, rule of three, maybe? Rule of three? Is that easy? She fucking waits like a second after I dodge. Every time. Elisa. Alright, health check. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. This might be worse than the Eddie fight. Or whatever the fuck his name was from 2. This is horrendous. Okay. At least we could shoot Eddie, yeah. Is this is this the pattern? Oh don't run. Please don't run. Please just end this. I guess I'll put this between us. I'm gonna waste all my fucking health here. Uh, uh, camera? Nope. I need to keep a thing between us so she doesn't like lay into me. Please let this end. I'm fucking begging you. Are we done? Like, please? Oh my god, dude. Oh, that was so bad. Like, what the fuck were they thinking? I use, like, all my health. I need to use one of these butt plugs. There we go. It would be better for myself to die. After all, it's nothing to be afraid of. That child, that demon, when I think of the endless pain it will bring when it is birth, I decided that instead of the suffering and cruelty I endured in that sick room, 
that I would like to bestow a more gentle and peaceful death on myself. Why do I resist? I never thought of myself as such a fool. Uh, Alessa. I guess it's kind of strange for me to call you that since you are me. But you know what? You and I don't think alike after all, and it's not that I don't remember that sick room either. All right. Well, that was actually dog shit. I assume there's a way to use guns, because it's all about, like, timing when you shoot, but I think melee just made the most sense. That way I don't waste ammo for potentially the final boss that's coming, but... Holy fuck. Her gun? She has an Uzi. I have the, I have the Uzi already. I just haven't used it yet. The door to the gate which leads to the road to paradise. Embrace the bosom. Ooh. The Holy Mother. Admit your sins and your... Okay, sure, whatever. Whatever. Oh, what's this? There's writing on the wall. Hey, after that, I literally don't care. After that horrendous boss fight, who gives a shit? How did you get here? He led you here. When will he cease his meddling? But it's just as well. Luring you here also serves my purposes. Checkmate. Checkmate, bitch. Checkmate. The time is not yet at hand. The time when all will be forgiven their sins. When the paradise we have long dreamed for will arrive. After the judgment and atonement, an eternity of bliss. Oh, Alessa, the world you wanted is nearly here. That's not what I want. Not you. Alessa, your true self. But I am Alessa. My little Claudia, my dear, sweet sister. Alessa, is it you? Oh, how I've missed you. I don't need another world. It's fine the way it is. But you said it yourself. The world must first be cleansed with fire. But that's not what I want now. Guys, I think I'm pulling Alessa, a prank. Don't you want happiness? to all the hopeless suffering in the world. We need, we all need God's salvation. Listen, suffering is a fact of life. True. Either you learn how to deal with that or you go under. You can stay in your own little dream world, but you can't keep hurting other people. Besides, I'll never forgive you for hurting my father. I wish only for the salvation of mankind. But for that to happen, the world must first be remade. And for that, we need God. You self-righteous witch! No one asked you to help! Okay. Oh, tarot cards. <clears throat> we're completely fine now? Oh, yeah, we were faking. We were just having a laugh. All right, this seems very finale area-esque.
Promise. Okay, that's a lot of text that I don't feel like reading. Hopefully it's not too important. Spencer, have a good night. Oh, is this my map? <laughs> uh. <laughs> okay, well, that's funny. It's better than nothing. She's going to hang out with the Dilf and Yakuza. He'll find a job for her in Purgatory. Okay, cool. Can I go? <laughs> oh. I forgive you. Should I turn my flashlight off? <laughs> like blinding into that little window. Yeah, trauma dumping a little bit. It's the light of God. <laughs> hey, I kind of just came in this room to look for like ammo or something. I don't. Can I go? I'm an okay. adult virgin. Thank you. Didn't need that last part, but I appreciate it. <laughs> Shout out to the person that's like, after all that trauma dumping. Uh, thank you for the thousand bits. <laughs> What's in here? Yeah, dude. Oh, shit. A more flashlight. Alright, we have all this whole church section. Let me look in here. Anything in here? Uh, oh boy. Excuse me. And nope, just a random enemy room. Firekeeper and Banasian. Thank you for the resubs. Oh yeah, that's like super locked. Okay. How was sign hole three been? Uh, it's been alright. I think it's a solid, like, three out of five kind of game. Three out of five yams. Okay. All right. <clears throat> of course. Definitely a, a play through the game once and uh, never play it again kind of game.
All right. Who's crying? Uh, me on the inside. I'm sorry. I'll shut the hell up. Oh, that's actually a save point. Okay. I thought that was just decoration. That works yeah, for me. Yeah, dude. Saint Jennifer. All right. Saint. Oh, that's me, Alessa. Where's uh, where's Saint Anger? Where's Metallica here? Is there anything over here? Or is it just like pictures? Yeah, that's me. Uh. St. Nicholas. All right. <laughs> Big guy's gonna be in front of me, right? Cassette tape. There are a bunch of papers in this file. I get the feeling that it's a handwritten copy of some book. Rep uh, represents the deity known as the Halo of the Sun. In heraldry, symbolize the religious group. The two other circles are charity and resurrection. The three inner circles are present, past, and future. Usually drawn in red, occasionally drawn in black or other colors, but blue reverses the meaning into a curse on God and is therefore forbidden. Uh, what is, uh, there's no label, but the tab has been removed. It may be worth checking out. Okay. Um, Hey guys, are you really going to body block me in this corner? Yep. Just let me through. Just let me through. Just let me through. That just let me through, please. Please. I just saved. So just let me through. Just let me through. How much damage did that do? You guys just want to, like, kill me so I can just reload, or... Just want to just get this over with. Wow, she did that really well. There was no impact noise there. She just kind of fell. Alright, I guess we'll clear these guys out. I feel like we have to. And then we have to find or figure out where we can use that thing. You know, let me use the fucking submachine gun. Why not? The oo-woozy. Twenty-two shots, huh? Okay, well, I think the shotgun is a better choice, but at least we use the Uzi. Are you? Okay, thanks for baiting me. Okay, I guess he's dead. Oh, baited me again. Can you, like, fucking die? I don't know if you're dead. I don't see any blood. No, oh, now you're asking for it. Here comes the big dog. Yep. 
Yep, okay. Still, st after all that, still alive, huh? Still alive. Can, can you just like, please? Alright, he's dead. Oh, that guy's still alive, though. Okay, he's dead because I can go through him now. Alright, we can aggro that guy and hopefully get around him. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright. Alright, can we get around this gentleman? If I didn't have the camera whip on me, then maybe. I'd only hit once, that's fine. I can live with that. Excuse me, Morbius. Alright, we got enemies in here now. I think. That's still locked. Um... What do I do with the cassette? Somehow I remember the stained glass. It shows God and the man and the woman who birthed her. Yep, 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 yep. That's fine. Yep, okay, yep, just fuck it. Pl please. Heather. I'm guessing I can't leave, right? Nope, locked. as much that's locked okay cool um hmm all right let's do a quick save since we got the cassette and then head back in and see where the fuck we're going Uh, Sign Hill 2 Enhanced was a fan project, yeah. Very, very good. If you're looking for a way to play Sign Hill 2, that's, that's definitely the way to do it. It looks and runs so well. It has all the content in there. And, uh, it is. It was a great time. I'm gonna go back to that big circle room. I feel like maybe there's more. Are you kidding me? I feel like there's more in there. Uh, the Sign Hill 2 remake is some point this year, I think, from Bloober Team. Oh. Here we go. Come on. Is that a fucking cow? Oh, wait, this is the boss from earlier. What? Oh, God. Uh. Alright, see ya. He got, yeah, he got demoted. After getting killed by <laughs> just getting shot in the back, he got demoted. There's a tarot book here. Tarot was based on the 22 Hebrew, uh, Hebrew, Hebrew consonants and is said to represent the entire world. Each card numbered 0 to 21 has a particular meaning by reading these cards, fortune teller predict the future. For example, the first card, the magician, signifies creation, wisdom, beginnings, or destruction, and fraud, second card, high priestess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like Yu-Gi-Oh for f fortune tellers. Sure. For the moon! Hey, man. 
Hey, Ark. You show up everywhere, don't you? You make me sound like some kind of unwanted pest. Well, who are you anyway? Haven't you realized that yet? Yeah, you're on Claudia's side. I told you not to put me in the same category as that mad woman. Well, you're pretty loony yourself. Whoa, a hard L? Bro. It's true. We believe in the same God. But I'm quite sane. So why did you help me out then? Was that also part of trying to resurrect God? It's not uncommon for people to worship the same God and still disagree. God? Are you sure you don't mean devil? Whichever you like. The point is that now I really am on your side. I don't want God to be born. It wouldn't be... Convenient. Much too unpredictable. So you've been using me to stop Claudia, is that it? Do your own dirty work. <laughs> My I'm so, dirty like, perturbed. I think we both had our own interests in mind. You hate her too, don't you? Ooh, excuse me. No, Thane, thank you. I don't have powers like you two. Besides, I always hated getting all hot, sweaty. Same. Oh, really? I'm just looking out for myself. Everyone does it. Huh. Huh. Don't stand there looking so smug. You're the worst person in this room. You come here and enjoy spilling their blood. Yeah, dude. And Go, Steve, oh, relax. To them cry out. Thank you, Wolf. You feel excited when you step on them and snuff out their lives. Are you talking about the monsters? Monsters? <clears throat> Yeah. Don't worry. It's just a joke. Oh, another jokester, dude. Bro, I killed like eight throughout the whole playthrough. I've been avoiding By most the of them. Way, I forgot to ask you. Did you get the seal of Metatron? What's that? You don't have it? Leonard was carrying it. It's called a talisman in my inventory, you fuck. Yeah, I have it. You mean this thing? Yes, that's it. As long as we have that, we're fine. Here, take this. Major Foley, thank you for the 44. Book Other World Laws. Uh, let's see. This magic square with strong protective and dispelling properties is called the Viron Seven Crest, or the Seal of Metatron. It will bring results regardless of whether the target is good or evil. Its strength, therefore, places a very high burden on the caster, as uh, as it is also difficult to control. It is not usually used. This is why it bears the name Met uh, Metro uh, Metroton, excuse me, after the angel uh, Metatron, also known as the Agent of God. Oh. Yeah, dude, sure. If you say so. Oh, I'm running low on health. I actually got to be careful. Nice status, yeah. Well, you know. Yeah, I'm not reading that. 
Uh, okay. Is there anything else over here? Hmm. I don't think so. Um. <clears throat> bop, bop, bop. Can I go in this elevator? Oh my god. Thank you, Heather. Just go around. Oh, I can. Sick. <laughs> I love this map. These guys. Y'all like noise? <laughs> Way too dang. I kind of remember this. Was this her, her bedroom or some shit? This is my sketchbook from 17 years ago. On the front cover, here's a picture of dad. Really awful work. What's this doing here? <clears throat> Sorry, Heather. Oh, my dress. The fuck is this? Oh, is this where I got to put a bunch of tarot cards? Okay, so this is probably the end of the game. Because that's how it was in Silent Hill 1. She's just beyond the store. I don't know how, but I can sense it. Hmm. All right. Oh, cool. We could save here. Perfect. May need to save a few times since I am getting low on, on health items. All right, I'm going to run to the bathroom one last time, and then we're going to hopefully finish this game up, chat. We're, we're fucking close. We're pretty close. I'll be right back. Hi, YouTube. We're back. Um, okay, so the lower area down there is how we... Presumably finish the game. Is this where I came from? No. Oh, it's in one of these rooms. Oh, there's two of you in here. Okay. Oh, is there a spooky alert? Oh, I'll check my alert things in one second. Hold on. Okay. Oh. Uh. This, uh, crying stuff is pretty fucking weird. What is this camera angle? Oh, is it just like, oh, are they telling me there's a door here? Ah, sneaky, sneaky. Ferris with the 6666. Hey, buddy, looking sharp today. Thanks, man. I do my best. I aim to please. Thank you for the 6666. Okay. So, uh, found this door. Oh, something in the book. Oh, another tarot card. The Fool. Oh, there's another heal. Nice. Definitely need that. Handgun bullets. Sure. Picture me when I was seven. I look bored and sad. Nice. Bored and sad as people when they watch my stream. When they watch any of my content. 
Okay. Can we with the fucking fat guys, like, cut the shit out, dude? All they do is block the path and take forever to kill. Fuck them. Excuse me, fellas. Just gonna go around. I think there's some more legs. Uh, I'm gonna save again. Gonna just start abusing saves here so we can try and, uh, not take too much damage. It's not my fault they were... Not their fault they were bo born in the hallway. True. Okay. Well, actually. Uh. Ha 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 ha! There we go. It's about to say. I thought I saw some out of the corner of my eye. Okay. Brass key. Brass key. Where the fuck do you go? Quick say in game. Oh, in game. You're welcome. I don't know why I'm saying it in game. Yeah, anyone see a brass keyhole? Oh, shut the fuck up. Yep. All right, we're back over here. I don't think I went this way. I don't think I went to the right. You like my shirt? Thanks. It's a Mega 64 shirt. All right. This is sus. What is that right there? Oh, I think that's just a tag. All right. Looks like this is just a fucking morgue. Oh, nope. Thank you, Heather. All right, that's four? There were nine spaces on there, but I refuse to believe there's nine cards. It's a puzzle, so. Oh, it's like Dad's room. Dad's not sleeping in the bed tonight, though. No, he's dead. Sometimes have the sense even now that this girl is a reincarnation of Alessa. Oh, hey, Dad, don't worry. Yeah, 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 my sweet and gentle mother. Oops. This is not... Oh! Okay. Okay. Ah, that door is locked. Fuck. Um, okay, I think we need to go back upstairs because I think I know where the lock is. Um, yeah. I think that's it right there for the brass key. All right, time to get hit as soon as I come out of this room. Nope, never mind. I'm a gamer. Gamer doing gaming things. Went the wrong way. Oh my god, get around that. All right, going up again. And now we want to go... Yeah, this way. He whiffed the spawn trap. Yeah, both of them did. I think there's a big boy enemy here. Uh... We will go. We will go save again. 
big save marker on the ground. Okay. Cool. And once again, safety save. All right, to the brass door. I think. Hi. Please move. Oh, camera. Okay, well, actually, that somehow worked out. Oh, my fucking lord. Okay. Uh, where's the door? I'm glad I saved. Do I have to fight my way out of here? I think I might have to fight my way out of here. I absolutely do. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Everything's just morbid, huh? That's where we're at. We're morbid. Welcome to the back rooms. I feel like the back rooms aren't as, like, scuffed as these rooms. That dude was just crawling on all fours. Okay. Sure. Uh. Go home, drop dead thief. This used to be Alessa's. I mean, this was my desk once upon a time. It's a girl named Alessa. Alessa in my class, if your memory is any good, you may remember her. She's the one. I said they called a witch. Okay. Thanks, Gordon. Where the fuck your name is? Um. Ooh, where's this lead? Oh, this is back over here. Okay. The flesh room fun for all ages. Oh, right. I have a tape. We'll hear some fat beats. Let's go. Do you know about what happened here 17 years ago? You've been here a long time. You must have heard some details. A group of pagans, blinded by earthly desires, spit in the very face of God. They tried to use the seal of Metatron to prevent God's awakening. But God drove the unbelievers away and threw them into the abyss. But due to their wickedness, God was unable to be born properly. Hey, when that happens. And so she has slumbered every <clears throat> day in the womb of the Holy Mother until the time of the awakening. That's all that I know. That's it, huh? Well, thanks. Father Vincent. <gasps> He's I a priest! Heard that the Holy Mother has been found. Is it true? Alessa has been found? Did Claudia say that? Yes. Then it must be true. Her sight rarely fails her. Bless the Lord! Maybe it was because of her great faith. I could never be like her. I wouldn't want to. Nor I. The truth is, Sister Claudia frightens me a little. Well, now, let's both show our faith by forgetting about this little talk, okay? Yes. But does that yes. mean this land will finally be the home of eternal paradise? If God wills it, my sister. If God wills it. Yeah, how can you forget a recorded conversation? <laughs> what? Oh, hey guys. See ya. Um... Card number five. That might be it. Old birthday card. She's still hanging on to this. 
To little Claudia, happy sixth birthday. I love you as if you were my real sister. Here's to you. That's cute. Ooh, her diary. I can't read this. This is rude. Bro, <laughs> any money. I'm sure she took the money. All right, so we have five cards. Um, I think every door is open. Yeah, I think, well, except, oh, well, that one is where we need to go. I think we just need to make our way back down. Yeah, can I, <laughs> I could summon Exodia right now. Oh, my fucking lord. Can you... This fucking game, dude. We're just like... I'm over it. Just stop adding enemies for no fucking reason. I can't even hit this guy. Oh, my God. Just give me a small opening. <laughs> Thank you. Let's just add a big fat guy in the way. Why? Because fuck you, that's why. Uh, Alright, we need to take the elevator again. Okay. Yeah, oh, I forgot about this room. I forgot about the party room. We're out. save so I think we're at the end of the game at least I feel like we're coming up on it yeah that is the vibe I'm feeling that we're we're near the end um Oh, no, I have to go this way. I have to go through the picture. Where the picture was. And then... Go over here. Is this the first day? Is this song underwater? I'm Silent Hill? Yeah, but I'm finishing the game up in one stream. There's really no space in the schedule for me to break it up into two, so I'm just grinding out the uh, the game. I should be pretty much done, though. Yep, there it is. Mm -hmm. No, the bad taste has already been left. I don't think playing the game for as long as I have has done anything. I think it's just the game itself that I don't really enjoy too much compared to the other ones. It's all the way at the end. Okay. Okay. So let's, uh, hmm, all right, let's use that one more time. It's not bad. No, I would not say this is a bad game at all. I just feel like it doesn't really do it for me compared to one and two. There's just a lot of interesting decisions. Also, like, you know. Combat is still the combat. It's so bad. But yeah, Heather's phenomenal. The, the door sure does rattle, but it's stuck tight. Five magic cards. Okay. Yeah, what to do? Or to Just so please. Oh, I should probably write this down. Okay, hold on. All right, here we go. Hold on, gamers. Oh, okay. Uh, there's something in each row. 
but that is not the half of it. Through three would be too hard to fit. Okay. The upside down man. Upside down man under the ground. To his right, to his left. There is no one around. Okay, so whatever card that is is by itself. Leave him alone, though his tears... Prefer okay, yeah, he, we just leave him alone. Sure. I have to look at the cards. The moon is up above the sky. Uh, the moon is up above the sky. Fuller, fuller crescent floating high. Twinkling light sits like a crown. Oh. On the head... Of a crazy clown? I'm about to bust. Hank, relax. Keep your clown fetish to yourself. Your Excellency, praying to God most high, do you think you can tell me why you always look up the night sky? Let's see. Praying to God most high. I'm trying to write down what I think are the key words or the key phrases, night sky. This is still fucking going. Jesus. Do you have it now? You didn't forget one major point. You must not omit. And now here's one more hint to keep you on track. Scary and hateful, that thing in the night. Better be careful. It's not. Okay. You know what? Let me just see what each card is right now. Okay. So High Priestess. High Priestess. Okay. There's number two on there. I'm not sure if that really means anything in Roman numerals. Oh, Hangman. That's the guy that's upside down. Hangman. Uh, that's 12. Okay. <clears throat> he says upside down under the ground. So I assume he's to his left. To his right, to his left. There's no one around. So he, he, I think he goes bottom middle. All right, the moon. Moon is, was that 18? The fool, which is zero. Um, the eye of night. Oh, okay, some of that shit seemed important. Eye of night is 22. And is that it? Yeah. Okay. It's locked. Yeah, let me see what I have with my notes here. So, okay. Whoops. Oh, I need to like, okay. They made the cards from Persona a real thing. They did. All right, Hangman goes there. Okay, and then... The moon is above the sky on the head of a crazy clown. Okay, so it's got to, the moon's got to be on one of the, uh, it's got to be on the top row, on top of the fool. Okay, let me write that down. Uh, moon on top of fool. And then let me quickly read the thing again. About the other shit, now I know what it is. I think I have an idea. Um, all right, notepad. Let's see. Upside down man. So I'm looking for like the eye of night and the high priestess. It's not on your right. Turn to your left and keep it. Scary and hateful. That thing in the night. Better be careful. It's not on your right. Turn to your left and you'll keep it in sight. Oh. Does that mean the moon is on the left? Chad, there's a lot of fucking words here. So you open the door. I'm just sure that there'll be nothing beyond it. Be left alone all day. What the fuck? 
me go one more time. Oh, when it says twinkling lights, it's like a crown. Is that like the high priestess, maybe? Do priestesses wear, wear crowns? Oh, here we go. Your Excellency, praying to God most high. Do you think you can tell me why you always look up at the night sky? Oh, maybe that's... Is that the night? Was it the eye of the night? The night on top of the high priestess? Your excellency? Okay. I think that's correct, but we need to figure out what the order is. Like, or, or where they get placed. Do you have it now? You didn't forget. One major point you must not omit. Scary and hateful, that thing in the night. It's not on your right. If you look left, you'll keep it in sight. Huh. I might be able to brute force it. Because I think I have, an, I have an idea of where the cards go. Let me see. Um, yeah. So if I do... Uh, this is the moon. So I think the moon has to go up. Um, well, let's, let's just do this here and put the fool... The moon goes on top of the fool. And then the eye of night goes on top of the priestess. Okay. Um, let's move this over. And then if that doesn't work, we could try moving the other stuff over as well. Oh, we got it. Okay, cool. I don't know what's supposed to tell you where it goes. It's probably somewhere in there, but I miss it. But I think, I, I, yeah, I was able to brute force it with the information I had. Okay, cool. Nice. Safety save there. Yeah, can we can we summon Exodia now? Uh, where the fuck am I? Okay, maybe over here. Sounds like they're already summoning Exodia, yeah. What do I want? I don't know. You're gonna tell me, I bet. Well, for the two of you to die. That Whoa, hey! Nice. Calm down, priest guy. Then I could relax. When did you stop believing in God? God lives. Just look around you. But I do believe in her. In my own. I fear her, and I adore her, but I haven't lost <coughs> my mind like you. You think that this is the work of God? Isn't this all nothing more than your own personal nightmare, just like Alessa 17 years ago? If this really is the work of God, then I'd say she has lousy taste. Oh, get her. <laughs> Who do you think you are claiming to know God's will? 
Go home, Vincent. Home? This church is my home. I built it with my power. The power of money that you view with such scorn. Although, I admit that this atrocious scenery is all yours. You know what? While this is going, I'm going to look what the perfume does. You continue Just realize I never used it. Then you'll kill me. Well. <laughs> well. The guest of honor has arrived. Let's get this party started. Heather, go ahead and kill this crazy bitch. Whoa, hey. This demon who claims to speak for God. Equipping it will attract the monsters, particularly nurses to Heather come. Mason. You can kill her now. What? Oh. Help! Oh, he's dead. Ripped ya. People say it's useful if you're going for the 10 star ranking because it gives you more monsters to kill. Wow, I'm glad I didn't use it, because that would just would have brought even more enemies. What an oddly specific item. <laughs> You're not going to run? I guess this is the end. No. He was gonna kill us, or he wanted us to die anyway. As Vincent said, the time has come. Vanessa, I'm saddened that you didn't agree to this on your own. to be released from the shackles of sin which bind them but I, I believe it was called a trap item in the old ps2 guide it was funny there's a lot of shit like that in this game there's like rooms that there's no point but there's an enemy in there or enemies is it so hard to believe that sympathy could be born out of pain and suffering why do you reject god's mercy why do you cling to this corrupt world Oh, he's still kind of alive, huh? You feel so guilty about it. Why don't you go to hell? Heather, use the seal. Vincent? The seal of Metatron? Yeah. Now your stupid dream is over. I got it from a weird water guy. That's just a piece of junk. What do you think you can do with that? I use it as a coaster. Do you really think it can kill God? I'm sorry to see you fell for my father's foolishness. What? <laughs> You're pathetic. What? I didn't, like, try to stop that or anything, or... Alright. But God loves even you. Now, Alessa, there's nowhere else to run. Oh! Hell yeah. Oh, no. You just accepted a 
Professor. The pain will disappear. We're morbid. Yeah, I'm fine. Shut your stinking mouth, bitch! Ho, oh, get her! Get her! I, am I supposed to shoot her? Is this a trap? Is... Hold on. Just in case. Start blasting? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Um. Now we're good, now we're good. I can't, I can't use that here. Okay. Use the perfume to attract the nurses. Oh, I wonder if I should put this back on. Like, none of these things do anything, right? Oh, that's a book. Dad's notebook. Oh, can I use this pendant? It's got the thing in there, right? Just a lucky charm? We read about, we saw this earlier. I wonder if this like I wonder if this changes an ending. Will this work? What are you doing? I don't know. I've never used this item before. Oh, oh, was that bad? Oh, I'm morbid again. Oh, did it, was that bad? Should I have just, sh should I have just shot her? Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, shit. My capsule of lean. I don't know, my dad fucking gave it to me. I thought it was good. Oh, okay. Uh, hey, guys. It, I. Are we good? Oh, we're fine. We got it out. It, it's out of us. We're fine. Look, it's... I don't know what that is. What's this? Dude, I thought you would know. Is, <laughs> yeah, is that God? Did I barf out God? I had this lean pill. Uh... Looks like God didn't make it. Oh! Was that really God? God is... Claudia. Is she gonna eat God? Oh! Yeah, this game is weird. <laughs> you guys ever eat a dead fetus that yes. someone just Can barfed out God? named God? Okay, this leads me to believe that I think this was the right call. Or at least maybe it'll alter the ending. This is a long-ass cutscene. I might make a save state. If I shot Claudia or waited too long, it would have been game over. Oh, okay. Oh, it would have been game over, and then I would have to, like, do the whole fucking thing again? Ugh. That sucks. 
That is t that's terrible. <laughs> Cause that cutscene's kinda long, and I'm not sure if you could skip it. You could skip? Okay. It's just another insta-kill. Ugh. Did did me dropping the jerky alter the game in any way? Like, is, is, am I going to get a bad ending that I dropped the jerky? You wait too long, the fucking train hits you. Oh, well, I guess that's where we need to go, huh? Need to jump down the hole. Well, is there a place for me to save or can I just like leave? No, I gotta do it for dad and Claudia. All right, let's go. Thank God I looked at that pendant like the beginning of the game. I'm like, this seems important. Jenny, see you later. <laughs> we need a mattress. You guys remember when we defeated Hentai with a hair dryer? Can't be dead. Like I four hours ago? You. Five hours ago? This is God. Oh, we're just in it. Okay. Uh, another little safe state to save some time here. I mean, what the f- What do you mean? Uh... Am I winning? Oh, fuck, uh... Oh, okay. Is this just like a shoot it a lot kind of- Oh, I don't have a map. Is this a shoot it a kind of boss, or- I mean, I guess they all are, so... Um... Okay. I don't have the range for this. Probably pistol. Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um. Oh, and then do I like just like? Can I just like Uzi it right here? Oh, right. I gotta watch out for that. Bitch got hands. So is it just like, and then, okay, she does that, and then I like Uzi? Oh, but the fire. Okay. This is going to be a lot of, a lot of switching weapons. What Dark Souls music is this? I know, right? It sounds pretty cool, though. The The music selection in this game has been pretty phenomenal for the most part. I say minus that one. Oh, wait, I have the stun gun. I have an idea. Wait. I got the stun gun, you son of a bitch. I'm going to tase God. Ugh! And I'm going to run away. Did that even hit? I don't even know. Alright. Now it's again like reset. Oh, get done with this shit. Okay. Oh shit, that hit me. Do I just like okay, I guess I just run in like a circle, I guess? Alright, and then we go back to we go back to the taser. Tase God! 
Yeah. Tase God again. One more time. I tase God. Okay. I'm out of tasers, right? And I'm, oh God, I'm already in the red. Jesus. Um. Just in <laughs> inhale the jerky. Okay, I just aimed at the ground. That was great. I wasted like 15 bullets. Huh. Jerky! All right, we're good, chat. We're good. We're good. I just laid down the jerky. Secret ending. I love the jerky on the ground. You can still see it. I wonder if it's good to just like. Oh shit. Yeah, I guess go just go back and forth with the pistol and the uh, shotgun. like make a circle this sure is a boss fight man you know what they all are they they're all they're all something <laughs> oh half of this boss fight is just a menu But you don't really play Silent Hill for the combat. All right, this strategy seems to be working pretty good. Oh, I think I may have fucked up that run here. You know what? You know what'd be great? A fucking weapon wheel. God, I hope that shotgun shell is hitting. It looks like it is, but I. Oh, hey, you know what, chat? For good luck. One, uh, one more. One more. Okay. Maybe I'll do more damage. Maybe I do more damage the, <laughs> the more jerky that's on the floor. <laughs> She's like reacting, so I assume the shotgun is hitting. You should finish with the mace. I I have no concept of how much health it has. Unless there's some like very obvious tell, I'm just gonna get this over with. Two pistol shots, shotgun. Couple ammo. Oh. I guess that first one didn't hit. Then you run a circle. Okay. Uh. I'm gonna be honest, I don't know if the taser even did anything. Uh, but it was funny.
God, I want to greed and get this, like, second shotgun shell off, but I don't think there's any point. It, it doesn't move from here. I don't know if I, like, got it stuck in a loop or if this is how the boss fight actually works, but I, you know, it's working. So I'm just gonna keep doing this. Does it just have a lot of health? I just, yeah, you have, you have no way to gauge, like, health. Okay, that was, oh, got a little too close. That was my fault, my fault. A little too greedy. Oh, we beat it. Okay, that was the whole fight. Okay, well, uh, I think that's Silent Hill 3. <laughs> what a fucking... Wow. What a game. We killed God, and now we're stomping it in the head. Okay. Wow. Alright, let's see what bad ending I got. At the end. Hey, is Douglas still alive? Does anybody know? Or oh, it is. <clears throat> Please, no phase two. Dad. <laughs> Dad. <laughs> this is some people in chat on Mondays when I'm not streaming. Like, bro, I'll be back tomorrow. Yeah, Henry died. It's a shame that Henry died, like, off stream. Or Harry, not Henry. Henry's his cousin. It's, a. Uh, it's sad that he died off screen. Like, I feel like it would have been a cooler thing it's like oh harry's back and then he's dead but no you just he's just dead you just come home and it's just like oh he's he's dead and then you kill the edward scissorhands boss guy the jewel she ate was the red goop that harry used against sybil to save her oh okay that makes sense oh yeah, uh, that's what we said. It's the lean. It's the lean. They reuse Mo Angela's model multiple times in this one? Oh. Well, I mean, yeah, you reuse models a lot in other games, I'd say. Heather. Yeah, this will be on YouTube tomorrow. What the fuck? Heather. What? Heather. Ah! Oh. Uh, <laughs> it was a goof. We got him. You got terrible taste. Bro, he almost shot me earlier. Heather, did you? You don't have to call me that. I'm not hiding anymore. You want me to use your real name? What was it again? Cheryl. Oh, she's using Cheryl. The name my father gave me. Hell yeah. That's cute. You gonna let your hair color go back too? I don't know. Don't you think blondes have more fun? Was that... Was that the good ending? Did I get the good ending or a good ending? Wait. Nothing bad happened. Did we do it? Cuts the fucking Heather dead in a car. I think we did it. Yeah.
I did it. I guess that's my dad. Rip Harry. Yeah, that was, uh... Yeah, I would say that's my least favorite. I think it's the weakest of the three. It's still good, but it's probably... I, I give it, like, a three. I'd probably give one, like, a 3.5 or a four. And then I'd... I'd probably a 3.5. I'd say, I'd say one is slightly better than this. And then I think two is the best, even though, uh... You know, the protagonist sucks ass. I really like Heather. He Heather's a great protagonist. I just, man. I feel like the combat was at its worst in this game. I feel like the camera was real bad. Uh, the first two areas, the mall wasn't great. The subway is ass. There's so many enemy, dude, the enemies that just show up in rooms you were just in suck so bad. But yeah, I wasn't crazy about the enemies either. Uh, the fucking like spinning spike guys. Ugh. So outrageous. Oh, dude, the body blocking. It's almost like they want you to use your ammo. Um, which I probably saw a shitload of ammo at the end, but I'm glad I saved it for that final boss fight. Oh, dude, the f the boss fights. Oh, we, that fourth boss fight with Alessa was so bad. It was so bad. There's, there, to be fair, there's probably a better way to do it, and I just rate it, but that was horrendous. I'm glad I didn't use a weapon, because I don't know, or like a, a gun, because I don't know when the best time to shoot was. But, I mean, the sword worked, and the final boss has a shit ton of health, so uh, I'm glad I saved my ammo. The final boss fight is just like a loop. <laughs> you just make a circle. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, this is definitely my least favorite. Yeah, the, the final boss fight is more menu than fight. But it's, uh, you know, it's easy enough. Yeah, I'm going to play 4 at some point. Uh, I don't know when. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to play 4. Who knows how that's going to go? Who knows? Who fucking knows, man? That will be a time. Uh, okay, we got that many stars. We killed the, the, oh, it's called the split worm. The, the, right, the penis with the, uh, foreskin. Killed it in a minute and 18 seconds. Missionary? Was that what the other boss was killed, called? Missionary? The one that killed my dad? Leonard was 249. Oh my god. The memory of Alessa took me seven minutes. It took me more time to kill Alessa than the final boss. Oh, I killed 37 enemies. 10 by shooting, 27 by fighting. I only killed 37 enemies. I ran past everything else. Holy fuck. Damn. Oh, I got the beam saber. Passwords and shit, extra costumes. Happy birthday. You're five months early, but thanks. Yeah, I mean, like, I didn't want to fight enemies to preserve ammo because, you know, survival horror game, but also because it's just not fun. <laughs> Almost four hours and 20 minutes, dude. <clears throat> oh, can I see the extra costume? Oh, 
Did I have to put in passwords? Okay. Um, yeah. Like I said, overall, it's an okay game. Not, uh, definitely not bad by any means. I think there's a lot of good in it. The music, the world build, building, Heather. Um, but I, I, I didn't like it nearly as much as one or two. Um, man, put Heather in another game, please. Please, don't, don't leave her here. It is dated. I think if it got a uh, an enhancement thing like two, I'd like it more. Or if it got remade, um, it'd also be good. She's in Dead by Daylight. Okay, well, you know, a real game. Please. YouTube, hope you enjoyed. Sign Hill 4 uh, in the future at some point, I guess. If you played all the Sign Hill games, even the, I don't know if you want to call them spinoffs, but let me know what your favorite Sign Hill game is if you made it this far. YouTube, thank you so much for watching. I love you. Bye-bye.